Hello everyone, this is HDS Gesky here, and as many of you know, I just finished Pokemon, I just finished Black Mesa, I've been finishing up a lot of the playthroughs on my channel, so it came down to what game did I want to play next? Well, I figured Pokemon was kind of my first strategy game on the channel, kind of a strategy game, so my second one, of course, should be Brood War. So we're going to be playing through the entire Brood War campaign. I hope you guys are ready, because I've been waiting to do this for a long, long time. And uh, in Brood War, you do start off with the Protoss campaign. The Deferi Zerg Overmind has been destroyed, and the Protoss homeworld of Ire now lies in smoking ruin. As the executor of the remaining Protoss forces, you must now attempt to reunite your be beleaguered people and save them from their ra ravenous Zerg, who still roam mindlessly across the blackened fields of Ire. Escape from Ire, isolated Protoss base on the planet Ire. Here we go. of mighty Tassadar. We must find the resolve to carry on. He sacrificed himself to destroy the Overmind, but many Zergs still rage across our ruined homeworld. Without the Conclave to lead us, or the protection of our great fleets, it seems we must fend for ourselves. Alderis is correct, Executor. As we have both seen, the Zerg will not halt their rampage until every last one of us is dead. I suggest that we retreat to our last functional warp gate and travel to where the Zerg cannot follow us. With all due respect, Zeratul, the Protoss do not run from their enemies. Ire is our homeworld. It is here that we shall make our stand. Just as your conclave did. they allowed their pride to blind their reason. Only if we learn from their mistakes can we live to avenge them. Now, Executor, I know of a place where we can find solace. It is Shakuras, the secret homeworld of my people, the Dark Tilmar. Your people? We would be seen as tyrants to them. Why would they shelter us? Have I not pledged myself to your cause? Not all beings are as unforgiving as your lamented conclave, Condemnus. You are right, of course. Executor, Zeratul shall find us passage to the warp gate. After the gate has been secured, Phoenix and the new Praetor Artanis shall lead our surviving brethren to Shakurus. Executor, I am Artanis. Though I have only recently been appointed Praetor, you can trust that I will uphold the honor and traditions of the Templar. We shall see. Hey boys, mind if we tag along? I figure you're heading anywhere has got to be better than staying here with the Zerg. Commander Raynor, as ever, your assistance is appreciated. We would be honored if you joined. Well, if the game volume's a little bit low, I won't talk during those briefings, so you can turn it up a little bit. Um, one thing I do want to say is that what I love about Brood War is they just jump right into the thick of things. They do not uh, baby step you along the way. So uh, we are going to go ahead and figure this out. Oh, what was that sound? What was that sound? Actually, hang on. Let me let me check one thing really quick. Options. Uh, is it sound? I want to make sure subtitles are on. There we go. All right, taking out that Zergling, and here we go. All right, continue on through. And what have you guys got for me? I gotta remember that using the middle mouse scroll button is not what it's like in uh, StarCraft 2. That is for sure. And so we're taking out the Nidus, uh, not the Nidus Worms, these are Nidus Canals. For those of you who don't know, they basically, they act similar to Nidus Worms, but they're a little more archaic. Just like everything in StarCraft 1, I feel like. And uh, go ahead and go down here. I guess the Overlords are more sophisticated, though, because all Overlords, you can see right here, were detectors. So they were actually able to spot every single cloaked unit in the game, and you had them at the start of the game, which was pretty freaking sweet. So we're going to go ahead and take out the uh, another Nidus here, because Zeratrul is totally badass. Got to be able to kill that off. So remember, Overlords, they can detect... Don't let them fool you. They are very good in this game. I remember in a recent cast. Oh, nope, nope, wrong way, Dragoon. Get back here. 
And also, they, uh, come on, Dragoon. Oh, God, Dragoons are so stupid. Ah! All right, he has somehow survived. I don't know how he managed to do it, but he did. Pathing is also terrible in this game, something to remember. Definitely something you do not want to take for granted in this game is the pathing, because you will die. You will die a lot if that is the case. So go ahead and take out this nice worm. And Dragoons are so stupid, man. So you will, you will rest assured you will have me raging at Dragoons by quite a bit. But uh, thankfully I've played StarCraft enough to kind of know how to baby them along. However, it is still it is still a trial in patience trying to use the Dragoon correctly. The Dragoon is good. He uh, He's most comparable to the Immortal. Alright, let's do it. Let's go join our brethren in battle. Oh, that's a big battle. That's a big battle. And Dragoons. Get down there, Dragoons. You're needed on the front lines. Alright, we just basically we just gotta keep an eye on Zeratul. As long as he stays alive, then uh, this pain train can keep on rolling. So we should probably kill this off with him. Because he essentially three shots it, which is always nice. Uh, we gotta be careful though. Time to back up. Just gotta back it up, back it up, back it up, back it up. Because my Zeratul will die. Alright, there we go. As long as these guys distract and kill off all those units. Zeratul can do the dirty work. Maybe you guys can kill this off, though. And yeah, boy. I love that they just throw you into the thick of things. They're like, hey, you want to pick up moments where the last game left off? All right. All right, we can do that. We can throw you into the mess that the Zerg made at the end of the last campaign. Ah, more Dragoons. More Dragoons. These guys have to be on a different hotkey because you can only have... Wait, wait. Can I have them all in one? Yep, there we go. All right, so you definitely have to use a lot more hotkeys in Brood War than you do have to in StarCraft 2. Because in StarCraft 2, man, you just hotkey everything together and uh, just kind of attack move your way to victory. Does not work so well in Brood War, so it's going to take a little bit of getting used to. Got to do the hold position micro. I think it's hold position for Dragoons. Either way, taking those out. Ultralisk Cavern. Hopefully there's no actual Ultralisk up here. That'd be bad. That would be bad news, Bears. And as long as Zeratul is doing good, remember shields also regenerate very, very, very slowly for Protoss. Oh god, there is an Ultralisk. Kill the Ultralisk. Zeratul, maybe, uh, maybe you'll just gather. Thankfully there's no splash damage on Ultras, so just make it a little bit easier to deal with. And surprisingly enough, they were actually a really good unit in Brood War, at least at the pro level. Oh, I can finally hotkey everyone together. Yay, we're one happy family. It only takes killing three of our brethren. But I'm sure we all have that one family member who we just would would disappear without uh, without any guilt associated with it. That's uh, that's what those two zealots or three zealots, whatever we lost were. They were super annoying anyway. Everyone knows it. Everyone knows it. All right, we got watch this sweet zealot micro. Yeah, you like that? You like that zealot micro? All right, add you guys, and then you two are gonna be controlled too. All right, well, hopefully, hopefully they don't go the same way that uh, some of the other brethren we found do. Because that was no good. All right, just be careful, Zeratul, because this spore crawler up here will spot our spore, spore colony. Oh, God, you can see I'm a little bit rusty, man. Maybe I'll just kill this. I don't need to kill the Ultras Cavern. That's just wasting everybody's time. Ooh, an Arbiter Tribunal. That's a unit I miss. Ooh, even better. Even better. Where is it? All right, so how does one go about getting down there? I guess we're just gonna, just we're just gonna figure it out as we go. Any anyone need size storm? Size storm! It does so much damage. One shots, Hydralis, baby. I will take it. I am okay with that. Can we please kill off this nice now? This thing's being, this thing's pooping out Hydralis, man. We gotta. We gotta deal with that. Hydras play a very different role in Brood War than they do in StarCraft 2. I would just like to say that. Uh, God, this game is so good. I always, I always miss this game when I start to play it. I'm like, oh, this is why, this is why I played this game for my entire child, eh, entire, entire childhood. My goodness, the dyslexia is kicking in. All right, High Templar, you gotta be careful. You're definitely, you, you still suck as fighters. That is, that is a fact. Oh god, where's Zeratul? Okay, he's up here. Alright, don't let the spine, don't let the uh, sunken colony kill you. 
All right, there we go. We should be okay. I could turn these guys into Archons, but Psy Storm is way more fun. And we're supposed to meet up with Jimmy. I don't know uh, what happened to him, but supposedly he did want to tag along, so. I hear Scourge, kill the Scourge. Wait, no, don't kill the Scourge. You guys back up here. Stay with the group. They're trying to ambush us. It's a trap. We must kill all of them. Slay all the Zerglings. Do not be distracted by the Scourge. They are but a decoy. Do these things gonna endlessly spawn here? All right, you know what? Come down here. We gotta, we gotta pass this. We are eventually going to just die from infinitely spawning Zerglings. All right, now I think they're done spawning. All right, there we go. And we'll come down over here. Hopefully my guys don't get too hung up on each other. Oh god, there's an Ultralisk. There's an Ultralisk. Everyone kill the Ultra! As long as their tool can't be spotted, we're gonna be fine. Oh my god, are they gonna spawn Ultras out of this? Why do I have a bad feeling about this? Why do I have a bad feeling about it? We better kill it right away. And down it goes. So we are gonna continue. Nope, ignore the Overlord. I know you wanna kill it. Don't kill the Overlord. They're not gonna hurt us. They are more scared of you than you are of them. Ah, I tried to use that saying in a previous cast, and I totally failed it. And here we go. We made it. Get us out of here. Zeratrul, come up here. I have located the warp gate. We must hurry and evacuate the Kamai survivors before the Zerg return. Yep, you definitely, definitely gotta go ahead and leave now. You got, you guys can hang out though. I mean, if you wanna, if you wanna have your last stand be here, then, then by all means. <laughs> Don't worry, Jim Rainer's tearing. He's overpowered. Oh God, move, Jim Rainer! Move, Jim Rainer! No, no, get away from the spider mine! Oh God. Ah, oh, I totally wanted to lay a fatty spider mine right there and kill everybody. That would have been amazing. All right, we'll do we'll do two missions in the first video just because these first missions are awfully short. Dunes of Shakuras, Protoss base camp on the planet Shakuras. In Toro Tassadar, Executor, the survivors from Ire have made it safely through the gate. Yet. Amidst the chaos of our retreat, we lost contact with Phoenix and Raynor. I fear that they may have been overrun by the Zerg. Fear not, Artemis. Phoenix is as stalwart a warrior as I have ever known, and the Terran Raynor has proven himself to be highly resourceful in the past. I for one believe that they made it here safely. suitable location for a more permanent settlement. Once we're situated, we can begin to search for the Dark Templar. Alright, establish a base and find the Dark Templar. I am quite a fan of Dark Templar. I don't think we need to show tips anymore, though. Alright, let's do this. Let's establish said base. And I think it's to the left, maybe? trying to remember it's been a while it has definitely been a while yep take him out take him out well that's just fabulous isn't that fabulous everybody that's just fabulous alright we're gonna go ahead and put that oh there's a lot of minerals here I am realizing alright I should probably build some pylons might as well get these going. And now we uh, we sit back. We sit back and relax. Let's get our fatty probe split going. There we go. All right. So uh, how are you guys? I'm doing. I'm doing great. Let's uh, let's see if there's if there's any tweets. Any tweets coming on in fresh off the press. All right. Let's see. I'm just gonna read some of these top some of these top tweets. Such a kind and benevolent lord you are. Wow. Uh, oh, that was talking about when I released the crickets. For those of you who don't know, I went to the pet store and accidentally bought the uh, extra tiny crickets, which my praying mantis just eats like popcorn. I meant to get the medium-sized ones. And uh, so I released 20 crickets uh, alive in the parking lot. I kind of felt like uh, kind of felt like a powerhouse being able to do that. It was like I felt like I was the emperor of like Rome or something there for a moment. 
And let's see. Let's see. Um, you made my day by starting Half-Life 2. So excited, says Bryce. Very nice of you to say that, Bryce. Um, sleep, sleep time, a.k.a. time to listen to the soothing cast of Husky Starcraft while I blissfully dose off into a dreamland. Black, 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 black. He's making Overlord sounds. All right, Brandon Khan listening to me while he's sleeping. Oh, yeah. And, um... Damn, I love watching Pro SC replays Husky Starcraft. I canceled my cable today. Hoorah! All right, uh, Lebleb Stanka on Twitter, you are doing it correct. Canceling, canceling the internet. Oh god! All right, yep, you guys return. Oh! Oh god, they're everywhere! Save me! Save me! Not the probes! Anything but the probes! No! No! Hi! No! 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 Why? Why is this happening to me? No, gather probes. You can do it. Oh, I ended up losing one. That sucks. That sucks a lot, actually. That sucks major donkey balls. Major, major donkey balls. Glad I am to see that you've returned home after these many decades. But the strange guests that have followed you here seem ill-tempered. Well met, my brother. <laughs> that was some Dark Templar humor right there. Have no regard for the sanctity of life. Once we have secured this area, I shall tell you everything I know about them in council. I'm sure the matriarch will be eager to hear your tale as well. Well, nope. We have received a transmission from Rainer and Phoenix. They are still alive and are fighting to retake the warp gate on Ire. We must secure the gate on this side without. Yeah, Jim Rayner. Now I have to destroy the Zerg base. Anyways, I love how we move in. Oh god, I need more pylons, don't I? I love how we move into this new, uh, this new fandangled planet, and we're like, hey, we're like, we're basically the scumbag Protoss right now, where we move on to their planet, we steal their resources, and we bring along all of our douchey friends called the Zerg, who are trying to kill everybody. Uh, that that's a douche move. I mean, no matter no matter how you cut it, that is a douche move. So. Hopefully, hopefully they're a little understanding that uh, you know we're not gonna we're gonna steal steal their beer and then leave without paying anything because we don't we don't want to be scumbags, see, but we are definitely scumbag protoss right now. All right, I got more I got more pylons, and this this is like the slow start, man. Imagine if like online games started this slow in StarCraft 2. Actually, they do. It's called Dota. <laughs> Oh, uh, that was a Dota jam. I really should be nice, though. A lot of people do enjoy those games. I uh, I should be nice. I, I do feel, though, that the game starts slow. I, I think that that's something that we can agree on. And if we can't agree on it, then we're just going to have to agree to disagree. We're going to have to pull one of those. All right, so I, as you guys know, am sort of a macro guy. So I tend to get my macro going pretty heavily before I really really do much else. I should probably build a pylon. How about you? You want to build a pylon? Alright, uh, how about down... No! My hotkeys. There we go. How about right there? Alright, we got another pylon going. We got our pro production going. We got neutral kakaroos flying around. And probe. And a one. And a two. And a three! Yes! Man, we are going to be hearing you have not enough minerals quite a lot through this playthrough. We're also going to hear construct additional pylons a lot because I, I'm, I don't know if you guys know this, but I'm actually really bad, and so I am going to be getting supply block quite heavily. And you need to come over here. I think we might actually be able to build a gateway soon. What, uh, what units does let me build? Quite a few there. Whoa! It actually gives me like all the tech almost. Wow. I think Fleet Beacon's the only one I'm not getting yet. Which is freaking awesome! Alright, we gotta start mixing in probes. You guys have to gotta start sharing mineral patches. That's just how it goes. What? What? Where is that? Where is that? Kill it! Kill them! Kill them all. I think we need to bring down a zealot down here so I don't lose anything. By those units just running past me. Actually, you need to come down here. Alright, gateway time. And boom. There we go. And we still got our pro production going. And we're at supply block. Time to drink some victory water. All right, victory water consumed. Not that Protoss have to drink victory water, but this Protoss does. All right, you can come back up here. 
We almost done, not quite yet. Maybe, maybe we'll build another pylon just to just to be safe. Cover all of our bases. And yes, yeah, I guess we'll just be down here. Right about there. And actually I wanna I can't remember, is there hidden minerals over here somewhere? I'm gonna go check. I am going to go check. Remember there's no auto mine. There's no multiple building selection. There's no really anything that makes this game easy. This is this is for elite members only. And let's see what that probe actually discovers here. All right, you are going to build a cybernetics core. So you're going over there, and no, there is nothing over here. So not uh, not anything hidden over there. I should probably build an assimilator. Actually, no, you come back over. You build an assimilator. Go back over there to work. More probes. Cybernetics core is on the way. Oh no, I messed it up. I think there are a hundred. Are they a hundred minerals in this one? Yeah, I think so. I think in Brood War there are a hundred because there's only one geyser per base as opposed to StarCraft 2 where there is two. Oh, should probably put this guy to work. And you should go to work as well. All right, wow, they give you High Templar and everything. This is, this is pretty intense. I should have got the gas a lot earlier though. That's, uh, that's my bad. Go ahead and build a gateway. Should probably just build a Zealot for now. And honestly, in Brood War, the more workers you have, the better, which I know is kind of the case with StarCraft 2. But you got to remember that in StarCraft 2, the pathing is so good, it's down to a science that, uh, you know, basically what you have is, I mean, they even tell you in Heart of the Swarm how many workers you need per per patch. And in this, it's just kind of, you know, the AI is so bad that the probes act differently every single time. So you never, you never quite know exactly how many you need. So you basically just keep making them the entire game. All right, let's see. I think I need to do one more probe in here. So there should be a probe always waiting. And Dragoon. Yeah, Dragoon on the way, baby. Put that down there. I should probably make a forge as well. This is one thing I love about Brood Wars. They seriously, they do not they do not baby you along. They expect you to already know the game and to be good to go. I do need a pylon though. I do need a pylon. Build pylon. And there it is. All right, another worker. You're going up there. We got Dragoons on the way. Yeah, yeah, they're coming. They're coming. Come on. Come on, Pylon. You can do it. And we will do that. Although, this will actually allow me to get Dragoon range, which is super overpowered. It is amazing. Although, the, let's be honest, Dragoons are still pretty derpy. They are still a pretty derpy unit. And they will forever be the derpy unit. I think there's a ramp or something over here, right? Am I remembering this correctly? I seem to remember being able to be attacked from this location, and I don't want to have that happen, so I'm going to go check. Uh, I'm just going to go ahead and build a forge either way. Forge is a forge is pretty good unit. IMO. Pretty good unit to have. And uh, we'll go ahead and send these guys down here just to see. Just see what they got going on. And the more, the more Dragoons, the better. There's one. Come down here. Probably build another pylon. Where's that happening? Oh god. Come on, Zelts, absorb some of the damage. You need to build a pylon right here. Apparently you can't block this off very easily. So we're just gonna have to go with that. And I guess there is no there is no ramp over here. Okay. Fair enough. Fair enough. Is that forge done? Yes it is. Alright, so I'm gonna build a safety forge back here. Because I do not want to lose all my workers. That would be no good. So safety forge right there. And from now on, it is mostly attacking units. A lot of which will be Dragoons. With Dragoon range. Because that is what I need right now. I could go for uh, for Templar Archives as well. Get out some Archons. Archons are awesome versus Zerg in this game. Oh my god, they're so good. And maybe I'll get one more Dragoon. Save up for... I think I need the uh, yeah, Citadel of a Dune. So we're going to put that up here. I wonder if I can just block off this whole thing. Come on, Probe. Where are you at? Come on. Make it through there. This is why, this is why you have to preemptively do something. This is like when you play The Sims. Have you guys ever played that game? Where, like, you have to tell your guy to do something about 12 hours ahead of when he needs to do it. The original Sims. My guy would wake up and be like, all right, I'm going to go to the bathroom. I have six hours until I have to go to work. And by the time he got out of the bathroom, he had already missed his ride to work and he got fired. And I'm just like, are you serious? Are you serious right now? Is this actually happening? That game. That game. 
or playing that as a kid. All right, I think that's enough probes for now. That's uh, that's about as saturated as you're gonna get. And Dragoon Range is done. I should definitely work on plus attack. So I'll get that one started and get this on the way. Citadel of a Dune's almost done, so we're gonna save up for the Templar Archives. Although, am I even gonna be able to afford those? I am not getting gas as quickly as I had hoped. But I'm, I'm gonna make it anyways, because Templar are amazing. And the fact that you can get them this early in the game, want to make sure, yep, you can get them right there, is pretty freaking sweet. And remember, in this game, when you build a Templar Archives, you can get both High Templar and Dark Templar at the same time. How dope is that? I'll tell you, it's very dope. Oh, dear. We all knew it was going to happen. We all knew sometime. All right, put that there. Did, did I finally wall this off, or is it still... Yep, you <laughs> You can just fit right on through there, whatever. What can you do? All right, we're gonna go for the four gates. Gotta, gotta really spice up our builds here from StarCraft II, going for the four gate. And once the pylons finish, we should be okay. So kill this bird, kill it. We must kill all indigenous life. All right, Zealot, Zealot. Actually, I can make a High Templar, not yet. It's almost done. Almost done, there it is. Oh god, kill them, slay them all. Thankfully, thankfully these DTs make it pretty easy. All right, so we need to do a Templar and also more pylons. And now that we got our economy going, we can actually move out pretty soon. I just, I just want to make one Archon. Can you guys give me the pleasure of making one Archon, please? I don't, I don't know why I, that's pleasurable, but it is, it is. Archons are amazing. All right, so we got Zealots rolling. I wonder if I should research Zealot Legs, man. Zealot Legs is so good in this game. Can I just say that? I sure hope so, because I just did, so. All right, what are you guys What are you guys fighting about down here? You guys are just being dumb. Did you lock someone out again? Lock them out of the base. All right, we got to set Rally Point, Rally Point, Rally Point, and Rally Point. Yes! Yes! High Templar it is! Where's his buddy? He's almost done. They're going to merge into something more powerful. It will be the Casting Archon. Alright, there's that guy. I'm going to work on getting Zelt Legs. Might as well. There he is. There he is, Archon. Come to me. Come to me. Oh, build it here. He is Zealot. Alright, my macro is rolling, yo. Okay, there's that. We are going to be moving out in no time. I should have plus one done pretty soon. And a zealot there. All right, I think we are ready to ride. Maybe I'll wait for this one last guy. Then we're going. We are going for it. All right, Autobots roll out. Plus we're supply blocked anyway, so let's make it look like we did this intentionally. There we go. And it's time to begin the onslaught. I also want to get more upgrades. That plus one's got to finish, though. No, there's so many. All right, I don't, I don't have a hero, Dark Templar, right? I don't have to worry about losing him. And yeah, those are on the way. You guys, you guys doing okay down there? It looks like it. At this point, I just kind of want a lot of Dragoons. I can't help it that I love Dragoons. They are pretty freaking sweet. All right, push down. Move down this way. I'm glad the Archon I made is doing a lot. He's just hanging out with, oh, he got his plus one, which means we need plus two. I wonder if we're gonna have to expand in this one. I don't actually know what's on the rest of the map. As long as it's not detection, then we can uh, pretty easily deal with this. All right, there's that. Zealot, Zealot, Dragoon. Take these out. Nope, DTs, stay alive. Stay alive, DTs, no! No, get out of there! There we go. Ooh, there's a huge base down here. What the hell? I'm gonna have to take this just to get the gas. I think I will actually send a probe down there. Oh, I have to wait for a million years for the creep to recede, but that's fine. Because there's no creep tumors in Brood Wars, so... Basically, that means that creep is very rare. It does take a long time. Well, it doesn't even take that long to receive. You can see how quickly it's going there. Definitely not like StarCraft where there's creep all over the map. Although, 
Although, on these missions, there's a lot of creep, just because they put the, uh, the sunken colonies everywhere, which are the ones that spread the creep. They must still be on ire. Oh, baby, baby. All right, who's the chosen ones to come join the army? All right, so I think my other mission objective was to kill a bunch of Zerg bugs. So, mission, mission accepted. Might as well go ahead and throw that down. While I wait for everything else. Zealot, zealot, zealot. And I should probably do pylons. Not enough minerals. Are you kidding me? And minerals, 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 minerals. There we go. All right, what's going on up here? All right, still, still killing off some, some Zerg bugs. I wonder if we're gonna have to do anything with this, uh, with this teleport a little bit. Do we sit back and wait, or what exactly is gonna happen here? Uh, Templar. What I have those on the way, don't I? I do. And Templar. Rest should be zealots. Keep pushing on down. I'm coming for you, Jimmy. Wherever you are. I will save you. Oh, someone got replaced, so you're coming on in. Delicious Archons. One thing about this game that I actually like, uh, well, it takes a long time to, oh dear. Oh dear. All right, Archon angle's good. Come on, Archon, you can do it. Can he actually do it? That's, uh, that's the real question right now. I think so. But uh, it takes a lot longer to learn the unit counters just because they don't say exactly what they do, their max damage to. And remember, in uh, StarCraft II, things scale upwards where an Immortal, for example, will do more damage to a certain type. In Brood War, they scale downwards. So, you know, it tells you what their full damage is, but if if you don't know what type the unit is, so say it's like a Zergling as a light unit, for example, oh, you're gonna die. Unless you have the high ground advantage. Ha-ha! Time for you to actually sh Oh, you're done. You're done. I might actually have to continue making reinforcements here because they are not looking good. They're looking pretty ramshackle down here. We do, however, have my Archon who has two kills. So that's kind of nice. But I'm just, just going to keep keep pushing on. Maybe, maybe make these guys into an Archon. And then all of you guys can be hot group number three, and you might as well just might as well just come on down. The rest of you guys can join hot group number one. You can also be joining us today. And keep on keeping on. Still can't build a nexus. Oh wait, can I build a nexus yet? I don't think so. I don't even have enough money anyway. What's it matter? I don't even have enough money. All right, apparently these overlords have got a death wish. They're just charging right in. And I think this is the only mission objective for this for this mission. We'll see. We shall see. I might need more, more, more pylons. All right, you are the pylon queen or king or king, whatever. Whatever you prefer. So yeah, you're hot group number one. And two, definitely could use an archon. Who couldn't use an Archon though? I mean, let's be honest. All right, you come down here, you come down there, you go over there. I think that that should be, there we go. My crew and I will remain here on Iron and shut the gate down on this side. It's the only way to make sure that the Zerg won't send more reinforcements to Shakuras. Sounds good to me. You will be hopelessly outnumbered. And once the gate is shut down, there will be no one to save you should you be overrun. Yeah, well, I'm a man of action. What can I say? I shall remain with Raider as well, Executor. My duty is to hire, after all. Farewell, then, brave warriors. We will send through all the troops we can spare. Thanks. You kids just remember to play nice from now on, okay? Wish us luck. Spoiler alert, Jim Raynor doesn't die. He's in StarCraft 2. All right, so the first mission's getting this started off right. If you guys want to see more, please make sure just to like comment and subscribe which is always so funny to say but uh if you guys aren't subscribed i do duly appreciate it so more starcraft on the way after this hope you guys enjoy it and i'll see you guys next time hello everyone this is hdsk here back some more brood war campaign playthrough action legacy of the zell naga 
Let's go ahead and get this started. I have turned up the sound just a little bit. Patriarch of the Dark Templar, and I welcome you and your companions to our world. Zeratul has informed me of the fall of iron, and I am deeply grieved. I am one of the few Dark Templar old enough to remember our ancestral home with clarity. Yet no matter how tragic the circumstances, it is clear that fortune has reunited our people. We, Dark Templar, will never forget our banishment from Iron, nor the Conclave's sins against us. But you and your companions are no longer of the Conclave. The example set by your fallen hero, Tassadar, has shown you that when the light and dark sides of our energies are united, our power is undeniable. But Matriarch, the Zerg who have followed us here are unlike any enemy the Protoss have ever known. You speak the truth, Judicator. And yet, there lies a dormant power here that can help us to scour the Zerg from Shakuris forever. Long ago, we Dark Templar were a nomadic people. But when we found a remarkable monument upon this world, we decided to remain here to study it. We discovered that the enormous structure is actually an ancient Zelnaga temple, dedicated to the race that sired us all. The temple is situated above a nexus of powerful cosmic energies. If we were to access those energies... Then we should strike now while the Zerg still muster their forces. Alas, we cannot. In order to properly channel the energies of the temple, we will need the twin crystals, Urash and Talus, that legends say were separated many ages ago. The Urash is laced with pure Templar energies, while the Talus is comprised of dark Templar energy. Only by using these two crystals in unison can we hope to channel the potent energies of the temple. Then it is clear that we must retrieve these crystals, wherever they may be. Agreed. But first, we must deal with the Zerg and their two Cerebrates who have already taken up station around the temple itself. To arms, my children. Scour the temple grounds of this foul infestation. Alright, here we go. Let me know how the audio levels are. Um, I definitely, every time I play a new game, I have to tweak around with it a little bit because it always sounds different on YouTube than it does on my computer. Oh. can be killed only by Dark Templar weapons and energies. My brethren will make short work of any Cerebrate. I'm waiting. Alrighty, so I, I do know in the last video the audio was a little bit of a, an issue. It was a little bit quiet. And so now I've turned up the oh. Our sensors show that the two satellites are surrounded by spore colonies. We will deploy our corsairs to compensate for their defenses. Oh yes, corsairs! I love you so much. I love you so much, corsairs. All right, get that going. More probes. We already have the Templar tech. Oh yes, here we go. All right, kill these ones. Definitely kill the sunken colonies first. The spores we don't really have to worry about. Alright, come down here. And kill it. Nope, nope, back out. Get out of that. It makes you not work either. I kill that. You guys go over here. Yes, we did it! We've done it! Alright, that was pretty easy. Taking that out, and I'm gonna go ahead and set up a probe up here. Oh wait, we gotta get guys in gas first. All right, you go there. I have also sped up the game to be played on fastest, which is kind of. Oh wait, there's a lot of creep. That's gonna take a while. Uh, I, I do know that the first couple of missions were played on the slower setting. I forgot that it defaults to that slower setting, just because I'm so used to playing it extremely quickly. All right, so let's see exactly what is over here, and it does look like no, no, there is nothing over here. Is this an island? Are we on an are we on an island right now? I feel like that may be may be the case. And just keep making probes. You guys go get to work over there. Ah, pylons, I knew it. I knew it. It's always the pylons. Let's go ahead and build it here. Go for you go over there. Let's just make a lot of pylons now, so I don't forget later. A pylon built now is a pylon not forgotten later, as the old uh, as the old saying goes. Alright, you guys come down here. See, I don't really trust. I don't really trust what, what's about to be happening here. So you come up here. You 
are going to be down there. And we got those going. All right, so now time for the Cybernex Core. How's the, how's the creep doing up here? Let's go check out. Aha! Uh -huh. I knew it! I knew there was going to be drops or something. Oh, God. Oh, God. What are you doing, Zerglings? What are you doing, Zerglings? All right, we got we to gotta go kill these. Not the weakened Dragoon, though. You, you're the special Dragoon who no one likes. All right, there we go. Should be, should be an okay angle. And there we go. All right, your turn. Your turn, buddy. More probes. Probes and pylons. All right, you come over here. You're part of the group. You're part of the group. All right, if they're going to be doing drops, I should probably build a forge. So let's try that. Ah, the creep proceeds so quickly. And down that goes. Oh, not enough minerals. Gosh darn it. Because of that stupid forge, now I have enough. But you guys need to go to work. And you can build a nexus. Let's put it down here. I think that's a little bit better of an angle. And that means we do need more probes. Probably going to need some units here pretty soon. Although, I can actually make High Templar. That is pretty sweet. So we're going to go for High Templar pretty quickly. I'm assuming that... Yeah, there's an island over here. I knew it. I knew it. Oh, nope, nope, nope. Stay over there. All right, we want to keep these guys alive for when we do the drop. So we're going to be working towards drops. Got to go ahead and throw down another gateway. Get some more probes. How long on this? Nowhere near close to being done. And I do want to say, guys, while this game is getting underway, that uh, thank you so much for the support on the, uh, seriously, on the Half-Life 2 playthrough, as well as the Brood War. I think those are already some of my most liked videos. So uh, thank you guys for that. I'm glad you enjoy it. Um, definitely, definitely keep leaving that feedback. And, yeah. I, you guys are the best. Thank you so much. That's all I wanted to say. Hope you guys enjoyed the live stream. If not, well, I, I don't know what to say because it's over now. So that's that's all I got. All right, more probes. And I wonder if I can put these guys up here. You think, that, you think they'll be safe? If I if I have them on patrol, you think they'll be safe? They'll probably go and kill themselves. That's uh, that's something that they, they really like to do. Corsairs, man, they will chase a unit like forever. That is just how it goes. I don't even want to get Psy Storm, oddly enough. I just want to go for Tika plus one. And I want to put a cannon back here just to be safe. Uh, put that up here. Who's attacking me? Oh, this is what I'm talking about. This is what I'm talking about. Lots of you. Don't kill it. Don't kill my gateway. What are you doing? What are you doing? Get out of here. Get out of here, dudes. Micro. Micro. Yes. All right, I'll take it. All right, so many High Templar, which is going to be so many Archons. All right, so we can probably transfer like half of these guys, if not more, up here. And we got to do the fatty split. Remember, guys, it's super important in this game because the, the AI on workers is so dumb. They will do exactly what you tell them to. You tell them to all go to one mineral patch, they will sit there and look at one mineral patch. And you're like, what? What are you doing? Why are you doing this to me? The most intelligent race in the universe. This is how you act. All right, time for Archons, because Archons are so good. Oh, God, they're so good. Oh, I need another Templar. You guys come down here. We can start getting Zealots, too. Although, I really have to start working towards the uh, towards the shuttle tech. All right, get that going. How are workers down here? This looks pretty saturated. So we're going to go and rally these guys up here. And get three guys for the gas geyser. Oh my god, we are rolling in macro right now. Are right, you do that? And we need zealots all day. No, I knew it! I knew it! This is what I didn't want to have happen! Oh god. Oh god, retreat. Retreat, get out of here. Get out of here, probes. Actually, I think we're gonna be. We're gonna be okay. You guys have just gotta stop dying. That's the only problem. Alright, alright. False alarm. Come back now. It is safe. No, they killed my pylon. Are you serious? No, probe! Probe, get out of there. Oh my god, he still killed it. Oh, that stupid Hydralisk. That stupid Hydralisk. Alright, you guys go there. And, wow, I actually got supply block from that. That was not cool, guys. Not cool at all. What are my Corsairs doing? Still being derpy as ever. Alright, so you guys can come up here. Yeah, yeah. Alright, there we go. And now I need you to build a cannon. And another cannon. There we go. All right. Good enough. As long as we get our few last probes going for the full saturation, 
we are going to be back on track. We should probably come down here now. You guys need to turn into Archons. And now, it is time for the Shuttle Tech. And I want plus two. Or am I going to be able to afford it? 150? Ah, not yet. I want the plus attack. It's so good. There it is. It's going to be awesome for my uh, for my beastly Archons. Okay, I think we're I think we're good here. I might actually need more probes and gas. I just realized. So we'll try that mini. See if that works out. And all right, so we got my oh, we got my awesome army. Actually brought up a folder there. Thankfully, it wasn't my porn folder. Am I right? Am I right? All right, so there we go. And I kind of actually want to get a second one. I don't know if that's overkill, but for now we're just gonna get more high templar. Yes. Now is your time to shine, Corsairs. Do it. These are so good versus Mutas. They may not look that good in a one-on-one -on -one battle, but when those Mutas are clumped up, man, it is it is over. No, not my Dragoon. Don't die. All right, there's that. I kind of want to work on Dragoon range. More Zealots. I should probably work on Zealot legs, because Zealot legs is amazing. And maybe one last cannon, just to make sure. Just to make sure. No, no, what are you doing? What are you doing? I knew this, Corsairs. You are so dumb. You've got to be put on hold position or something. All right, you know what? You guys, you guys going over here. You are now forbidden. You are forbidden from playing until we do the drops. All right, man, I'm getting a lot of gas now after getting that uh, expansion going. Oh, I'm going to be supply block, though. I need you. Right there to build pylons. Are we are we doing okay? Everyone okay down there? I know, I got the pylons on the way. Don't need to tell me. Alright, three pylons. And basically what I'm gonna do now, this is my plan. I don't know if it's gonna work or not, but I'm going to basically make a bunch of shuttles and then drop them. That's the plan. Plus add the plus to attack. We got Dragoon range on the way. We got the Corsairs. There's that. These should be done soon. Yes, I'm feeling good about this, guys. I'm feeling good about this. Basically, this video is just to test the game speed and audio, make sure everything is actually working according to a plan. Yeah, I, need, I think I need to build another one of these. We gotta, we gotta speed this process up a little bit. What? What? Oh no, they're gonna kill it! They actually killed it! Ah, I'm so sad. If they kill this other barracks or gateway, no, no, they're gonna do it. They're gonna do it. Quick, aggro them. Yes, nice save. Nice save, 19 HP. God, that was so close. All right. We're going to have lots of shuttles. Double shuttle trouble. I'm almost already maxed out again. Wait, no, you guys. You know what? You go away, you stupid overlord. We got we to gotta build some pylons here or something to protect this. All right, more Templar. More shuttles. You need to get back to work. More pylons. There we go. It is now protected. We almost got double shuttles. I'm really excited about this. Really excited about this double shuttle that we're about to have happen. All right, you guys do that. Shuttles on the way. Let's just get double shuttle going. Double, double shuttle. And the plus three attack. All right, I think we're almost ready. Everything's, everything's rolling. And more Archons. Basically, this is going to be the Archon army. And let's see, plus two. There's that. Oh, yes. Oh, this is, this is going to be glorious. So glorious. All right, we could actually probably start loading these up, right? Maybe maybe build a cannon down here just to just keep our enemies at bay. Come on. Oops. Tell him to return cargo. He's like, I'm trying to return it, Husky. Just stop telling me to do that. All right, and one more. All right, so we should be safe to leave our base. You guys should definitely become Archons. What? Oh, wait, cannons. We got this. I knew the cannons would pay off. All right, so our shuttles are looking good. Let's go ahead and load up the Archons. Oh, my God, it's going to be so many Archons. You guys don't even know. You do not even know what's about to hit you right now. Although I never got Zell legs, which is kind of sad, but whatever. What can you do? Uh, are you full? Yep, you are. Let's get uh, let's get some more zealots. Zealots are always nice. And let's wait for one more shuttle. And then we're we're gonna do it. We're gonna do Operation Doom Drop. I think we're gonna drop maybe down here. 
Let's uh, let's just see what's over here. Definitely don't want to lose the shuttle. Yeah, we're gonna we're gonna do it right there. We are gonna do it right. Oh my god, these have shuttle speed. I think they do. They definitely do have shuttle speed. All right, you need some dragoons in it, and maybe maybe one more shuttle just to uh, just make myself feel better. Uh, whatever. Whatever. That shuttle's almost done anyway. All right, you come down here, build that. Attack. You're full, full, full. All you guys are ready to go. And here it is. Uh, I need to bring these guys, that's for sure. And we'll bring the rest of the zealots. Alright, here we go. Alright, so you guys are control one. Nope, don't go over there. Don't go over there. Nope. You guys are control two. Yeah, keep these guys out of here. Oh, no! Oh, God, they're gonna actually drop it. We're gonna go for it. I think we can handle it though. Are right, you guys? You guys back up. All right. I hope you're ready for this disruption web on there. Let's do it. Oh god, I think they all used it. I forget that it stacks. Whatever. It's super disruption webbed. Quick, unload, unload. Oh god. There we go. There we go. Keep unloading. Somehow that shuttle managed to die. But I think we've unloaded everything. Head on back. Oh my god, my macro! My macro! You guys become Archons! You! Build more pylons! Also more gateways! We need more gateways! I think though, this is probably gonna be enough to just kinda crush on through. Now that the drop has been successful, we should be A-OK. -okay. But just to make sure, we've gotta add to the madness. Actually, I kinda need some more DTs. Wait, K is apparently the hotkey. K. K, 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 K. All right, you guys, load up. Need more. Need more reinforcements. Unload there. Archons are on it. You guys are so slow. This is what plague used to be. It didn't do damage. It only slowed you. Although it wasn't called plague. All right, Dark Templar, kill that. Where's my other Dark Templar? Also, do you guys still have units inside? What's going on? It's taking so long. All right, the Zealot's helping out there. And this battle stretches far and wide. Nope, Zealot, okay, you're done. All right, you should be able to kill it off. You have to use the DTs to kill this off. And success. You guys are so bad. Why are you not attacking? Probably don't, probably don't need the shuttles in there. All right, you attack. Oh, that shuttle died. That's what you get for not obeying direct orders. I don't even know where my other DTs are. Here's the one DT, though. And let's see, I need to bring over more DTs. Here they are. Oh my god, so many DTs. Screw it. Make more. Make all the DTs. All right, you two. Come over here. Unload up there. Oh my god, I think we got this. I think we've definitely got this one. And, oh god, oh, get away from there. Unload, nope, nope, don't do it. I know you guys, I know you're all pissed, but you just gotta wait, okay? You just gotta wait your turn. Gotta wait till it's safe to go in. All right, now it's safe. Come on, DTs. Nope, Archons don't need to help. And the rest of you guys, kill that. That should, I don't know if that is the mission or if I have to kill all the Zerg too. All right, DTs, join in the fun. Uh-oh, is this Kerrigan? Is this Kerrigan? If this, nope, don't listen to her. Don't listen to her, guys. She's got to try and be a snake. Well done, mighty Protoss. I'm glad to see that you're uh, as violent as ever. Kerrigan. What kill her, Zeratul. What is this? Kill her. warriors. Despite what you may think, I haven't come here to fight you. This is laughable. Do you truly expect us to believe that your intentions here are honorable? That these Zerg here are not under your sway? Look, the Cerebrates you've killed were my enemies as well. If you let me explain, I'm sure you'll understand that- You are the enemy of all who live, Kerrigan. What makes you think we would have anything to do with you? Because, Zeratul, I bring news of an event that threatens us all. If you'd be so good as to escort me back to your citadel, I'll tell you everything Don't I do know. Don't do it! Very well. Don't Jeremy. do it! It's you a trap! What you have to say, but be warned. 
We will not suffer your treachery here. Oh, man, they're trusting Kerrigan. The first rule of StarCraft is never trust Kerrigan, whether she's human or whether she's Zerg. You cannot trust her. All right, we actually managed to beat that one very quickly. Uh, this one was basically just to test audio, test game speed, all that. Let me know how it looks. Thanks again for all the thumbs up and comments and subscriptions and all that. You guys are the best. You make me want to cry. All right, I hope you guys enjoyed it, and I'll see you guys next time. Hello everyone, this is HDS Guest here, back with some more Brood War campaign playthrough action. Let's just go ahead and leave, pick up right where we left off, the quest for the Ouraj. And that is, the, of course, the crystal. So I think we picked up Kerrigan along the way. We are the Protoss fleet orbiting the planet of Braxis. Braxis looks like kind of a boring planet from outer space, but whatever. Now then, Kerrigan. Perhaps you had best explain yourself. What is this news you've come to give? There is a new Overmind, growing on chart. What? Impossible. Why should we believe anything you have to say? Because, Zeratul, I'm no longer the mindless murderess whom you fought on Char. The Overmind is dead. Whatever warped control it once had over me is gone. I know that this is a lot to take in all at once, but you've got to believe me. There's more at stake here. She lies. Than... She is infested to the core. I, for one, will not listen to any of this. Silence, Judicator. Continue, Kerrigan. Apparently, many of the renegade cerebrates commanded by Dagoth have merged into a new Overmind. Fortunately, the creature is still in its infant stages. It can't control the swarm yet. But Dagoth and the others still have control over most of the broods. The two cerebrates you killed here were part of Dagoth's forces. Look, I don't need to tell you all what might happen if that thing reaches maturity. I can guarantee you that should it awaken, it'll take full control of me, just like it did before. I don't want that to happen, and I'm pretty sure you don't want it to happen either. Even if what you say is true, our priority is to save this world, not assault the new Overmind. We must find the crystals Urash and Kallus before we are all vanquished. Then I'll help you with your search. If you can defeat the renegade Zerg gathered here, it'll weaken the efforts of Dagoth and his ilk. My children, you must put aside your fears and misgivings to accomplish what must be done. For the time being, Kerrigan will assist you in your endeavors. Though she has been your enemy, it is enough that we share the same agenda now. Allow her time enough to prove herself to you and you may find her to be a valued ally. For now, you must focus on the task at hand. Search for the Urosh on the planet Braxis and let nothing stop you from recovering it. We will do what you ask, Matriarch. But you cannot expect us to forgive Kerrigan's crimes against our race. Executor, prepare our forces. We shall debark for the planet Braxis before the next moon rise. I told you guys, don't trust her. Don't trust Kerrigan, but you someone out there thought it was a good idea. Uh, we got a drop coming on in. Rolling in, boys. All right, what do we got? Oh, we got Reavers. Reaver, 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 Reaver. All right, uh, Reavers, you got to come up here. Don't waste all your scarabs. We got to save those for later. We have got to be saving those scarabs for later. Well, I feel like my Reavers are still attacking things. No, I set up here. Come on, Dragoons, you've got this. Prevent the Reavers from wasting all their ammunition. Oh, there goes one scarab. Oh, it's gotta get stuck on the minerals. All right, Reavers, you gotta move back and forth. We gotta save some money. We are min-maxing right now. We are trying to keep as much money as possible. All right, you guys kill that. Even the probes can join in the fun. The Reavers will be up here min-maxing all day. Explain something to me, Zeratul. Why would your people leave such a secret crystal in the hands of these Terrans? We didn't. Long ago, this world was a Protoss colony called Kirador. When the strife between our tribes escalated, this planet and the Urash crystal were abandoned. These Terrans have come here only recently. Alright, those stupid annoying Terran neighbors, no one likes them. Alright, we'll use the Reavers to take out this bunker. And you are going to deal with this. Come on, Kerrigan, you got this. Oh, God, thank goodness that does not do splash damage. All right, Reavers, come back up here. 
save your ammunition because scarabs cost money. Something of which we do not have a whole lot of right now. All right, so we're gonna put that there. And probe's gonna come over here. Did I, did I lose a probe? Am I missing a probe or did, I, did he die? Very well could have died. That is that is known to have happened in Husky Starcraft's army. All right, so there's that. We'll put another pylon down here. And you know, I kind of want to build a fort as well. I don't know if that's, is that too risque? Oh, I can't build a forge, huh? Cause I need a nexus. All right, and forge, forge, let's do it. I don't even think I'm gonna have enough money to uh, get the upgrades right away, but whatever. We have a problem. Our warp matrix was damaged during transit. Because of the extensive damage, we will be unable to warp in stargates to this location. What? No stargates this location. Balls. I guess they don't want me winning with mass carrier, eh? Alright, so you're gonna come down here. You two, come over here. I really want to get plus one attack going as soon as I can. I'm pretty sure I lost the probe in the midst of all of this. Alright, you're coming over there. You're over there. And maybe make another probe. What is it now? I I'm gonna adventure out with Kerrigan in just a moment. Once I get once I get this uh, this kind of rolling here. So there's that, and one more probe. Yes. All right, Kerrigan. Why, thank you. I'm trusting you, Kerrigan. Let's go. Uh, let's go this way. Aha! Let's see if they have missile turrets. Nope. No missile turrets for you guys. Sucks to be you. Yes. That's gonna be a lot of free kills here for. Good old Kerrigan. Yes. I always like that uh, that attack noise that she gets. All right, we can work on weapons. Yay! I don't know why I'm going for weapon upgrades so quickly, but I don't know. Upgrades are pretty good, and we definitely need some gas going on. So we're gonna get you down here, you over there. I've noticed on these missions that uh, there's definitely a gas to mineral ratio discrepancy. So you want to get as much gas as quickly as possible. And I feel like going for production facilities is probably the best move right now. Because while I can kill those guys, I've only got a limited amount of energy. Structures are the most important. That's that's how I'm feeling. How are you guys feeling? I don't know, but I definitely need another guy on gas. Alright. Everything. Oh, what's going on? Reaver, you don't even need to help out with this right now. I think these dragoons have got it. I think the dragoons have got it. Reavers, you can come back up here. You guys are just for emergencies only. Because remember, there is a high ground advantage in uh, in Brood War. So that means that units on the high ground are basically overpowered. Which is pretty awesome. Alright, another pylon. Not enough minerals. Not enough minerals! There we go. Alright, Kerrigan's going to town onto this. No, not the SCV! Whatever, Kerrigan's still got it. She still got it, man. No worries. There's that. Maybe kill the command center here. What is it now? Might as well just take out that whole base, cause uh, I gotta, I gotta move in there. I highly doubt I can beat whatever this mission is on this one base. And I kind of want to get another forge, but at the same time, I should probably build a gateway. Gateway is probably a good idea at this point. Yes. Come on, come on, stupid SCB. What is it now? Whatever. I'm just, I'm just gonna let her go to town. She's having fun. She's getting a workout. And I think, I need one more probe on here? Is that, ah, no, that should be pretty good, I think. Yeah, close enough. Close enough, having lots of gas is Protoss is good anyway. Because you, uh, you go for High Templar, man. That's just how you do it. All right, put another pile on there. You guys get to work. I'm just gonna keep making probes because uh, I'm gonna take this base pretty soon. As long as I keep my Kerrigan alive anyway. Otherwise, I will end up losing the game. Let's go straight for a cybernetics core. Almost done the upgrade. Very good. Kerrigan being sexy as always. And, oh, come here, stupid, stupid fire bat. Yeah, just uh, just go off and kill. Oh, there's more bunkers up here. Got to kill these bunkers. Quick, kill the bunkers. I do not want them. And, yep, here we go. And then I'm going to get the armor. What's the hotkey for it, just so I can remember? It is indeed A. So we gotta work on that. And 
These Dragoons are killing it, man. Nine kills and five kills. Dragoons are so freaking good versus Marines. And yes. Terran don't have the overpowered Marauders in this game. Hey, what are you doing? No, go for this. All right, there's that. And I kind of actually want to go straight for Citadel of the Dune. Give me the extra upgrade unlocks as well as Zealot Legs. Work towards High Templar. Yeah, there you go. You guys still doing okay? Fire bats are definitely worthless. Hey, who are you? Get out of here. You're no longer allowed here. All right, anything left? Oh, I'm gonna take a risk. What's happening? Come on, Marine, you've got this. Oh, Reba, 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 Reba. Very nice. All right, only five, four, oh God, three, two, one. Oh, woo. All right, that's when you go hide in the back of the base so you don't die. That is that is a very common problem. All right, so there's that. Let's go for Zelt Legs just because you're, you're always going to have Zelt, man. And I feel like I need to save just in case. Kerrigan level. Because I do not want to end up losing her. All right, Dragoons, you should probably let the lady in, even though she's a mass murderer who's killed billions of people. But you know, but you know, we should definitely trust her, right, guys? Right? Said no one ever except for the matriarch. And maybe, maybe we get another forge. Put that there. You're also going to build me a Templar archives. Put that back there. More probes. And start working on some dragoons. And we need more gateways. Actually, where's my, where's my guy making the Templar archives? There you are, VT. All right, so that goes up there. Now let's go ahead and build more gateways because we are going for a gateway-centric army. Yes, Reavers are good, but uh, we, already, we already got quite a few of those. So let's see, one right there. Let's put that one right there. And one more. I want to make sure I don't trap anybody. Let's put one last one here because we are going to have another base here eventually. Lots of probes. Oh my god, tons of probes, actually. And I think we are right. I'm going to put one more probe on the gas just in case. It actually helps me be more efficient. And Templar, baby. Templar. We have got to start getting them Archons out. Especially with my plus upgrades I'm working on. I could actually get a shield upgrade, but we're going to go for armor first. And yep, now we gotta get zealots. What? I totally thought I was. Alright, we need a pylon. Oh, one will totally fit up there. We gotta make our base as efficient as possible because it's pretty darn small. Another probe. Yes. Yes, Archon baby. And yes, we will be using Size Storm later. Don't don't fear. Just for now, I want to get out some actual units. Oh, Zilla Legs is done already? That was so fast. And pylons are done, so time for some more Zealots. Uh oh. They've actually got quite a bit of stuff here. Hopefully, hopefully no cloaking yet. Okay. Good, no cloaking on the Wraith. And maybe Reaver back up a little bit. You back up. Just want to make sure not to take too much damage. Alright, we got the Zealot army on the way. We go, trying to spread out the production. Did you never make? Wait, well, yeah, I guess you did make the pile. And I'm just, I'm just building units so fast. Okay, you guys become an archon. You guys up here looking good. I should definitely bring along you for the ride. Let's go ahead and put a cannon up here so I can bring the dragoon. I'm gonna put the cannon there. And also, in case they send me a cloak banshee, which I don't even know if they have the technology yet, let's put that there. Alright, so you guys are here. Go ahead and move on down. We got good upgrades going. You can scoot down here so your scarab angle isn't bad. No, 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 over here. Come on, come on, Pathing, you can figure it out. Let's get some dragoons just because they're pretty good. What, again? My goodness. My macro is out of control right now. All right, you're not trapped in there, are you, probe? All right, so we'll put another pile on there. So you guys are going to be one, two. 
All right, let's go ahead and uh, start taking some stuff out. I think they still have, yeah, the siege tank down here, but why, why are we not attacking the siege tank? Definitely go for the siege tank. Oh, you did get some cancel it. Oh, can you fit, get out of there? Yay, okay, that was close. I know, I had to cancel one. It's a sad day for all of us. I'm trying to find a place where I can put pylons. That's not gonna block everything. Looks like right here should be okay. Definitely need to send down a probe to secure this base. Let's see what else we got up here. Any any buildings down here? Nope, just some units. Oh, uh, upgrades are so good. I'm sending two one. Oh, there's some buildings down there. We'll we'll go for it in a second. Was that a drop? Or was that? I saw something on the map. Upgrade complete. And let's get some more Templar. Because Templar are amazing. Need to get another pylon. Where can I fit the? Oh, you're gonna fit up there? Yes. All right, this guy, you're gonna, you're next. You're next, because you are building a nexus. There we go. Another pylon, just for good measure. And we gotta secure this gas in just a moment. Let's get some more zealots mixed in. Assimilator! All right, everything, everything is on track. Uh-oh, stupid, stupid, uh, vultures, man. With their overpoweredness. We definitely need some more scarabs, though. All right, scarabs all the way. All right, here we go. Take them out. Take them all out. Oh, God, they do have tanks up here. But guess what? I've got zealot legs. Go, go, zealots. You're so good. Screw it. We're going all in. We want to get more upgrades, though. Definitely more upgrades. Come on, make it up the ramp. Yes, this army composition is so good. How I've missed you. Wait, wait, I gotta cancel some of these. I need, uh, I need, I need more upgrades. Armor. No, not shields. Armor. All right, is this, uh, is this a whole base? Can we take out this base? What is up here? Let's find out. There's a dropship over there. Uh, zealot, 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 zealot. I'm trying to decide if I should keep making Archons, or if I should keep, or if I should research Psystorm. I mean, Psystorm is pretty ridiculously good in this game. Let's be honest. All right, we definitely need like the majority of you guys down here. All right, so there, there, there. Keep the spread going. It takes a while to saturate this. All right, you're going up there. Oh, actually, we cleaned out this space pretty easily. What? A, go a ghost on the high ground? Get out of here. Get out of here. Did we ever make that pile under that stupid ghost kill? I bet he killed it, didn't he? All right, well, just in case, go ahead and drop a cannon there. And a robotics. We got to get an observer. Just in case. I don't even know if we need any more probes. Kill that dropship. Kill that dropship. There wasn't even anything inside of it. All right, let's get some more scarabs. And let's see, you guys need to be control three. You guys need to be an archon. We need more zealots. Oh god. Oh no, back it up, back it up. I don't know what's all down there. We should definitely wait though. I think we have upgrades nearly done too. Eh, not quite, but whatever. Okay, you guys should be just fine here. And yeah, we were mining well there. I think we can even send a couple more of these guys down. And yeah, let's go. Let's go for some dragoons. What? What? A siege tank attacking me? This is blasphemy. Oh, Zelt sounded so cool back in the day. Why do they not sound that cool anymore? Why do Zelts not sound this cool anymore when they attack? All right, no cloaking, right? Maybe we should get some observers. Oh, oh, I forgot you have to build an observatory. V, oh, is that the hotkey? There it is. There it is. All right, still more zealots, I guess. Oh, well, Dragoon, you're uh, you're gonna act as a cannon for now because you're kind of derpy and got stuck. All right, here we go. Reavers, where? Why are you so slow, Reavers? You are so slow. 
Gotta keep up. And observers. So we'll go ahead and rally those down there. Come on, dudes. You can do it. You can do it. You can make it up that ramp. I know you can. I know you guys are thousands of years old. I know you can do this. Oh, it's because this one's mined out. That's why. That geyser is depleted. I was wondering why I was getting it so slowly. Time for more pylons. So there's that. Alright, here we go. Full on attack, baby. You guys have got this. You guys have got this. Coming in. Get a nice concave going. Good luck. We're all counting on you. Alright, time for some more dragoons. Let's uh let's send these elves down here to see what we can find. Oh, this is this is going very well actually. Yeah, oh, this feels so good. This brings back memories, guys. This brings back memories. I think we have a base up here. Oh god, there's stuff down here. We got stuff everywhere, man. Dragoon, 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 dragoon. All right, these elves going to town, taking out some bases. I think we're actually uh, doing pretty good here. Our macro is impeccable. Right, let's see, does this bunker have anybody in it? Nope. Either way, we're going to kill it off. All right, you guys come over here as well. Because I don't want my Kerrigan getting intercepted on the way down. Knowing my luck, that's exactly what happened. All right, let's see if there's anything down there. I think we can go ahead and bring Kerrigan down now. I think, I think it's got to be safe for Kerrigan to move on out. Just in case we're going to cloak her. All right, just come down here. Cleaning out all these units. All right, I think we've done it. I think we've collected uh, crystal number one. I have a feeling crystal number two is going to be a lot more difficult. Hey, what are you guys doing? You need to come up here. There you go. There's some more stuff ready to kill. You guys need to do that. Hey, what are you doing? Why are you resting on the job? You guys got to come up here. Oh, God, I didn't hotkey care again. Hopefully, there she is. There she is. All right, we're hotkeying her to number one. Just to make sure we don't lose track of her. But I think that we pretty much got this at this point. I just like making giant Protoss death balls. Even back then, with di giant Protoss death balls were fun. Ah, whatever. All right, she's almost there. Stay on target. I think we, I mean, we definitely got this at this point. There's not, I don't even think they have a single production facility left. All right, taking out these turrets. And where are you at, Kerrigan? Yes. Wait, wait. Do I need, what, what was the mission objective? Bring Kerrigan to the garage crystal. Okay. Wanted to make sure it wasn't supposed to be a worker. Then I had to bring a probe all the way down here. Ta-da! Crystal's here, boys. Send in a probe to gather it up, and our work here is done. You have done well, Kerrigan. There's more to you than it seems. Perhaps I have misjudged you. Given our history, I can't say I blame you. Let's just get the job done. Don't trust her. She's been killing Terrans all last game. She's only killing Terrans to to trick you. Don't you dare do it, Kerrigan. Or Zerachul. Zerachul, I love you so much. And now I just don't know if I can trust you anymore. Because you're working with Kerrigan. All right, guys. So hope you enjoyed it. That one took about 20 minutes. And uh, yeah, I'll see you guys next time. Kerrigan. Kerrigan, Kerrigan, Kerrigan. Hello everyone, this is HDS Yeski here, back with some more Brood War campaign playthrough action. Without further ado, let's get to the Battle of Braxis. Protoss fleet high orbit over the planet Braxis. Executor, our sensors have just identified a large group of Terran vessels. However, their configuration profile is unlike any Terran group yet encountered. We are receiving a transmission from the fleet's command ship, identifying itself as the Alexander. Propos Commander, I am Admiral Alexei Stukov of the United Earth Directorate. We are here to take control of the Terran Dominion and all of its outlying colonies. 
You are in direct violation of Terran space and have openly attacked Terran troops. Lower your shields and power down your weapon systems. The UED will be taking custody of your ships and whatever spoils you have garnered from this planet. United Earth Directorate. Raynar spoke of the distant Terran homeworld called Earth. These humans have come a long way to make war on us. Have faith, Zeratul. You almost sound as if you fear these humans. What are they to such as we? Was it not we who defeated the dreaded Overmind? Yes, Artemis, we did vanquish the Overmind. But we did so with the help of humans. Do not be so quick to underestimate them. Of course. Executor, I shall test the mettle of these humans by scouting ahead of your ships and finding a way through this blockade. In Toro Tassadar! Alright, it is time. I think we get Artanis on this mission. Yes, Artanis, my favorite hero ever! Oh yeah, these things totally have scout speed. They are they are balls fast, man. Alright, let's load up you guys. Let's load up you guys. Let's figure this out. Oh, what's going on? I can get some observers up here. And either we're safe to unload, we can unload up here. Oh, oh, watch it, watch it. I think we can unload it up here. Oh, no, back up, back up, back up, back up. You guys are not very good. I do not, nope, nope, nope. Don't go, hey, 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 stay, behave. Yay, stop it. All right, scouts, you are in timeout. You're in the timeout corner. All right, let's go ahead and unload these fools here. And I'm assuming this is one of those games where you do not, uh, you do not build anything. Definitely doesn't look like a base is going to be happening anytime soon, that's for sure. We have to focus. We have to lean closely in to look at our screen. And let's see, can you guys get down there at all? Let's see. I don't think that you can. So you're going to come over here. You guys are going to take those out. And do you guys have full upgrades? Hey, you're at 222. Two, two. Pretty close. And anything up here? Oh, bunker. We gotta wait. We'll wait for that one. Stupid, stupid scouts, man. They have always been absolutely terrible. Can I just say that? I am ready. Because I'm going to say that. Because they have been always terrible. All right, here we go. Here we go. Time to attack this. Oh god. Uh, anyone in the red? No, you guys should be okay. There you go. All right, let's back up. Let's back up. Let our shields regenerate for a second. Let's uh, contemplate our next move. Looks like so far it is mostly going to be turrets here. So we're going to go ahead and send this off on up here. Oh, no, back up, back up. Don't you do it. Don't you do it. Come here. Come here. We want to go. Someone up there attacking those people. What was that? All right, here we go. Charge! Go, scouts. You've got this. You've got this, scouts. Oh, no. Don't overextend. All right, you guys, come kill all this stuff. No! Stop! All right, hold position. You guys are officially on hold position, okay? That's all there is to it. No, there's no avoiding it at this point. Right, let's kill these turrets first, just in case. All right, let's just take out... Let's just really take out all the turrets. Because our scouts have so far proven that they are a bit antsy. Let's just say that. That's the term we're going to use, is antsy. I don't want to use the word stupid. Is that a ramp right there? I bet my dragoons would not fit up there in a million years. Nope, they definitely cannot fit up there. Because they're too fat. Oh, it unpowers everything. All right. All right, fair enough. With the power generator destroyed, the missile turrets on this platform are no longer operational. However, we will need reinforcements to finish the job. Reinforcements are en route now, young Templar. Confirm. I am ready. They, they aren't even hostile right. anymore. I think it actually gave them to me. I like have vision of them now. All right, where's my reinforcements? All right, so we got yes. DTs. We got some dragoons going on. And I guess it wants us to retain these units and I guess keep using them. I guess we'll load up these. All right, well, here's my awesome sauce crew. You guys right. are going to be control three. And let's see, where exactly should I go? Is there anywhere safe? Let's go check this out. I think we even have shuttle speed. We got all sorts of fast units on this mission. Thank God they didn't give us the slow units. All right, so. Nope, nope, don't you do it. I concur. Nope, nope, nope. Not today. 
All right, let's uh, let's go ahead and unload all of these. And come on, you still got something in there. Someone's still hiding something inside of them. There we go. All right, so hotkey group number four, which is all of yes, you guys. You're coming over there. You guys are all hotkey group number one. And go ahead and take these out. You should be able to do that. Got our awesome uh, strategy going on. Alright, there we go. Alright, right. we, uh, we can try and help out here. Maybe help out with this. Yeah, take out some of those units. That'd be good. That'd definitely be good. Now you guys can work here. Oh, maybe the scouts need to be a little bit careful. All right, all right, you guys are messing it all up. Everyone back up. Everyone back up. Back to one. We're losing observers. Let's try this again. How am I supposed to kill that missile turret? Can I do it from over here? Gosh darn it. Right there? There we go. All right, that one Dragoon's on that job. How are you doing? Artanis took a lot of heat. Yeah, you guys, you guys are on timeout again. I feel like I shouldn't have to put you on timeout this much, okay? Oh god, science missiles. Consider it done. Yeah, I'll set you guys control three. Here Indeed. we go. Here we go. Yeah, get away. Get the hell away from me. We gotta back these guys up. Back you up so they can get through. Where are you guys going? That's definitely not the most uh, best way to go. Alright, we got all that. Where are you guys going? Why are you so bad? Why are you so bad? I usually have to say this to my horrible allies in 4v4 online, but this time I'm saying it to Dragoons. All right, wait, wait, hang on, let's kill this thing all at once. There we go. All right, we should be able to kill this stuff. Should be able to take that out easy to breezy. Am I even supposed to go this way, though? I don't know, we're about to find out. Uh, you guys can come up here. Kill that off. There is the power generator right there. So that's good to know. Alright, let's see what's up here. For hire. Might actually be able to unload. Indeed. Just unload up there. I think that's what I'm gonna do. Alright, everyone. Load up in the dropships. Medivacs would be very useful right now. Can I just say that? Did I get everyone? Alright, we're not leaving anybody behind. At least not intentionally. Nope, get back over here. Why do these things have such long range? That's what I want to know. Alright, so we're gonna go ahead and unload up here. Nope, nope, back up, back up. There you go, you can deal with that. Come up here as well. Is that, is that seriously all the dragoons? There they are. What took you guys so long? No! Alright, alright. Group number four. Time out again. No, what are you doing? What are you doing? These units are so dumb. What am I supposed to do with such dumb units? I mean, for serious. Alright, kill this. So we're gonna come up here and we're gonna kill this. Hopefully these, oh, there's a lot of visitors down there. All right, let's see if I can, if I can pull this off super awesomely. Nope, you guys need to be right there. All right, you're gonna back up and go there. So you guys should, you should be able to handle this. If not, I have lost all faith in the Protoss. And maybe it was, a, maybe it was for the better that we replaced the, uh, the Dragoon with the Stalkers. Okay, I think it's gonna be just fine. Nope, nope. Gosh darn it. Gosh darn it, they got a lot of stuff. Even a siege tank was killing me. Alright, so let's think about this. There's a bunker over there. Can we kill it from here? Let's just try it. Hold position. I think we are going to be able to get plus two, plus two is pretty good. That fire bat's got a long way to go if he wants to do damage to us. Oh, we can actually attack him from here. OP. Can you, can you get up there? Over here. Over here. Where are you going? Right there. Yes. Yes. I found the sweet spot. There we go. Now we're talking. Now we're talking. Oh, that just made this so much easier. Reinforcements are en route now, young Templar. Thank you. Yes. Thank you very much. Alright, so you guys go in there, you go in there, you go in there. You guys are control group number four. 
So we're going to fly over here. So the next one is in this location. That siege tank could prove to be quite the nuisance. So what I'm going to do is... We're going to use these guys. You're going to hold position. There we go. And who has, uh, who's got more dragoons? You do. I think that's all we have in this far as we're concerned. Alright, so our dragoon count's looking pretty good. Kill that stupid fire bat. Let's come over here. And attack that. Oh god. Oh god, siege tank. Stupid siege tank. Can we kill this from here without the tank shooting us? Nope. Can at least get it in the red. Yep. Alright, so. That means, aha, the tank! Your tank is vulnerable! So we gotta kill this really quick. And then the siege tank is gonna be vulnerable. You guys should back up, though. <laughs> I have you now! Get out of here, you stupid tank. Alright, we got that. Uh, careful. We gotta be careful. We can attack these guys from the high ground. Very nice. Alright, let's just go ahead and scout around. Just to see. Looks like we got a lot of uh, missile turrets. As is expected. Go ahead and unload everything now. Alright, anyone not unloading? Okay, so you are gonna come up here and fight this. That should be easy enough. Free is gonna swoop in here. Take these out. Kill that stupid freaking tank. Nice. Got another tank over there. Alright, let's see if we can do this. Nope, nope, back it up. Alright, let's try this. Let's see if this angle is good enough. Come on, kill it. Kill it. Kill it, get out of there. Oh god, what are you guys doing? What do you. You guys really don't like that missile turret, do you? Alright, ba guys, it's like babysitting children. Alright, you guys come fight over here. Let's just send everything. And just hope there's no siege tank. You guys, are you still trying to figure this out? Alright, we took out that stupid wraith. What? There's a bunker? Kill this freaking thing. Okay, can you now kill this turret without being spotted? There we go. Okay, good enough. Good enough for me. Yes, executor. You guys, do, I'm totally gonna save. Totally gonna save because this level is super frustrating. All right, take out that stupid bunker. Kill all the marines inside. The nice, juicy, juicy marines. All right, very nice. And you guys are gonna keep fighting up here. You guys are going with. The scouts are gonna stay over there. Alright, we can kill a Goliath on the high ground. That shouldn't be a problem. I just don't know why. Like, why do you think that's a good idea? Why is going that way all of a sudden the best idea ever? Alright, at least they don't have cloaking. So that's nice. Nope. Time to move on through. Somewhere safe, hopefully. Right here? Is this safe? What? How, how did my Dragoon die? That stupid Goliath! Alright, we gotta we gotta deal with this stupid Goliath. Where'd he go? Where'd he go? Come on, I know you're over here. I know you're over here somewhere. Oh, guys, coming all the way around. All the- I- I give up. I give up! I'm not even gonna deal with that right now. We do see one of the power station things over here. Means I do want to deal with this. Where are you guys going? Seriously, whatever. Kill this thing. Kill this bunker. God, you guys. No, no, get out of here. Is that the weakened one? No, that's the one we gotta send these guys back here for. All right, kill that off. And we got. All right, took care of that. Come attack over here. Can you guys even do anything right now? I feel like the answer is no. No, you're just gonna stay there. We're gonna kill more missile turrets. Let's uh, let's scout this out over here. Should be able to kill that and take out this. Don't you dare! I put you on hold position because I do not trust you guys. While they do that, I'm gonna go ahead and kill off as many of these. 
And that should be able to power down everything in the area, though. So that's nice. Yeah, you know what? I'm just going to take my time, kill these off with my awesome scouts. Even though they recharge their shields so slowly. Oh, my God. I am ready. All right. Took them out. Reinforcements are en route now, young Templar. All right, what do we got? Show me what we've got. We've got High Templar. We've got Reavers. And apparently more Observers. So we're going to go here, shift, there. All right, shouldn't take them very long. Don't you dare fly over that bunker. If anyone is caught flying over that bunker, it is your own fault if you die. That includes you, Observer. Yes. All right. Should be okay. All right, so now for the challenging part. Where do we go next? Let's go ahead and unload these guys for now. Direct my rest in these guys. Try and figure out which angle to attack at. Definitely not that angle. All right, so this isn't looking good this way. We might have to go attack the other way, which means we've got to load up a lot of dropships. I get the High Templar, Doom, Zealots, and you guys. They do have ten. All right, let's just get let's just get these guys. All right, four, three. All right, so four and three go over here. There they go. And leave this guy back over there. Observers. Here. Your will. And we are going to be attacking at some ridiculous angle. State your will. Am I seriously going to have to unload them all over here? I think so. I think the answer to that question is, unfortunately, yes. All right, let's see if I can do this. Can I kill this missile turret without getting shot? Kill it. Kill it. Very nice. Very nice. I don't know where that tank was, though. So let's go find it. It's time for tank hunting. Oh, well, can't really hunt all that much. All right, so we are definitely going to be fancy about this. Screw it, everyone clump up. Everyone clump up. Here we go, here we go, here we go. All right, everyone follow this guy. And then I'll unload at once. Let's just, let's just see what we end up with. Hopefully enough to engage this directly. Anything else you want to unload out there, guys? There we go. All right, so you're all control one. I'm counting on you guys. Siege tank or no siege tank? So be it. I want you all to go in at the same time. Everyone go with the buddy. Everyone go with the buddy. And no scouts, I need you. Yes, kill the tank. Kill the tank. We gotta keep these guys alive though. Alright, we at least killed the tank. That's nice. That's good. Good side. And we can finally kill these turrets. You guys just need to kind of waddle on over here. Direct my You need to come join in the turret killing. Alright, I'm feeling okay. We lost quite a bit during that, but like where are you going, homie? What is so important that you have to run this far? Oh god. Wow, that didn't do any damage to him. You can see like one shot like a boss. Alright, you you know what? You can go do whatever it is that you were gonna do. Because you just you just killed a spider mine by yourself. All right, so let's uh, let's kill all this on the way, and this DT you can kill that off. But I think for the most part we should be should be in the clear here. We'll scout. We'll scout with the God. He's got 15 kills. This guy is a monster. Oh God! Not well. Now he's dead. But he was cool while he lasted. All right, so we need to use some uh, some observers. I feel like. Nope. Don't go too far, guys. We gotta, we gotta be very careful here. All right, there we go. That's what I'm talking about. Nope, nope, that's not what I'm talking about. We are not talking about that anymore. All right, hold position. Zelda, you come down here. Dragoons, you're basically my last hope at this point, so don't screw this up. Hopefully you have trained Dragoon Rain. What, lockdown, are you serious? That is not cool. Oh, that's even less cool. That is way less cool. All right, we at least killed that stupid ghost. 
Alright, let's see. There's probably another ghost over here, huh? God, lockdown lasts for freaking ever, man. Alright, let's see what we got. So we got these. Let's see if I can get a good angle on them. Alright, clean out these mines. Don't you dare lock me down. Don't dare lock me down. Go ahead and go over here. Can I kill that from here? Nope. God, they are such jerks on this mission. Alright, we gotta we gotta load this up for sure. Come on, shuttle, pick these bad boys up. No, back up. Don't you die to that siege tank. Back up. Alright, let's see. We can totally do this. It's gonna be fine. It's going to be fine, guys. Here we go. Here we go. Unload! Unload! Oh, we got one of them out of there. Oh, God. That was not fine. That was the opposite of fine. Uh, well, maybe I can kill this ghost over here. We'll try that. Let's try and get these dragoons down here. I really hope I didn't screw this up royally. All right, kill that. No! No, not the siege tank! No! Oh my god, I'm gonna lose every dragoon. All right, at least killed that ghost. Did I even kill this missile turret up here? Oh, they shoot so far! Direct my wrath. All right, well, For well, I don't know about this. I just need to kill this missile turret. Yeah, there. All right, we got the missile turret. So that's a good start. I think at this point, at this point, it's all up to the zealots. Did I lose my dropship too? Of course I did. Oh wait, where are my high templar? Someone's got high. Oh, well, thanks guys for joining the party up here. Really appreciate it. And I am ready. Yes, executor. Let's see. All right, there's the high templar, which I should have been using this whole time. But it may be too little too late. All right, we need zealots. We're gonna do some zealot bombing and some dragoon bombing. This is definitely the most efficient way to do this. I don't want to hear it out of anybody. All right, right there. Oh god, there's a lot of stuff up here. <sighs> okay. State your will. Here we go. Here we go. Quick, just unload him. Just do it. Just do it. Oh god, there's a guy in here. Side storm. Side storms everywhere. Uh, side storm over here too. Yeah, there's zealots. Oh god, I almost lost my hero. Get out of there. Get out of there. You gotta kill that off. Alright, it's all up to you, Zealot. I think you're my last attacking unit. Oh, I got one Dragoon down here. Uh, should I make this into an Archon? That's the real question. Hopefully they give me enough units to actually pull this off. Because I definitely messed that up. Are there ghosts over here too? Let's find out. Yes, of course there are. Alright, another- Oh, I already killed him. Don't need to do that. And ghosts don't have snipe in this game, so that's at least good. There we go, should be able to kill him off. Yep, there we go. Oh god, that was so close. Maybe, uh, maybe let's save. Maybe, maybe let's save this. Don't even know if I have enough now. To pull this one off. What is all this stuff? Oh, that's all the mines, okay. We can at least spot the mines. Maybe I should send this dragoon out. His job, his one and only job, is to kill mines all day. And let's see what we got down here. We got Arbiters, we got Corsairs, we got Scouts, and a couple of Zealots. Not many, though. Alright, so all you fools, just for now, go that way. We gotta, we gotta lick our wounds, see what we've got. For now, we're just gonna clean up these mines so I don't mess this up. Alright, so you're gonna be over here. Actually... I want to see you on a, on a much more important mission. Don't you get too close. You guys don't have anything inside you. We're just going to go ahead and move those over there, though. We do have one random DT hanging out here. He's an absolute coward. And any anybody else? I guess we could send, we could send these guys into this. Probably be a lot quicker than this one for you. All right, so let's group everything we've got including these units. And let's just let's just see what we've ended up with. And is it enough to actually make anything happen? Alright, you come over here, you're over there. 
We got our one Dragoon. My so I have these guys finish off these mines. And then we're gonna go for it. Uh, Observer, where you at? Here you are. All right, so we are gonna scout with this little guy. Is this where I actually wanna do my landing? I'm, I'm voting yes. I vote yes. And I also vote that Archons are really good, but I don't know if it's the way to go yet. All right, so there's that. You guys go in there. Dragoon, you join the Dark Templar. And you four. This is all we've got, this is it. So we're gonna find out if this, if this is what it takes to be the very best. All right, so right now, let's go ahead and throw out a Disruption Web on that. Thank you, get one more. Thank you. You guys are going to very delicately unload. We don't know what's just beyond that fog of war. All right, everyone, everyone unloaded. We're gonna get these medevacs or dropships out of here. Not medevacs, they're technically shuttles. All right, now we have no idea what's over here. And I do not want to mess this up, so I'm sending in my best observer. So we'll see. All right, there's a Valkyrie. So far, so good. All right, I think we can handle this directly. Using, you know what, I kind of want to, I really want to turn these into Archons, but I don't know if they're going to be invaluable later. So for now, I've got the one Dragoon, and I've got the Zealots. So we're going to, we're going to use the Zealots for now. Keep the Dragoon just in case. Go ahead and attack that with that. And careful with the Dragoon. This guy and Dragoon goes in as well. Keep the High Templar alive. Now we start doing lots of damage down here. And ooh, there is the Arbiter. I forgot about him. There's a lot of Flunkers. So far. But at the same time, I can actually get these guys over here now. Alright, group up. Try to attack this missile turret without dying. Alright, you got that. Back out. Oh god, there's more bunkers. There's too many bunkers. Full on retreat. Let's try killing this one off. And it's done. Back out. Back out. Let's send in our observer. Oh god, battle cruisers. Stay your will. That is not a good sign. Indeed. Unless, let's see, I can kill. Oh god, not the Valkyrie. Not the Valkyrie. Victor Goon, cover me. Very nice. Alright, take that out. This should be in the red. Anything else over here I need to take out? Yep, please fly us. Alright, we're gonna try. We're gonna try something fancy. And I want these guys to be Archons for it. Oh wait, it's not letting me make Archons. No! All right, so you're gonna come over here. We're gonna use this awesome ability called Recall. You guys are probably familiar with it. And here we go. Yoink! All right, have fun, dudes. That is all you. All right, Size Storm on that. Yeah, another Size Storm. Another Size Storm. Another Size Storm. Size Storm's pretty good in this game. Oh, but he killed my Dragoon. Not cool, man. Not cool at all. Alright, you guys stay over here. I think we can take this out. Should be pretty easy. And done. Very nice. Very nice. We're getting some traction. Oh my god, I think we got it. No, there's another battle cruiser. How could you do this to me? How could you do this to me? Back up! Alright, you guys attack this. Side storm. Side storm. Side storm. Keep the storms going. Keep the storms going. Alright. Close enough. Can I run these guys up here now? Don't run by the bunker! Why would you run by the bunker? Oh my god, we totally got this. We have totally got this. Woo! Talk about a stressful level, man. That, that's like the longest freaking game I've ever played, I feel like. Alright. We'll unpower those. What do you have to say for yourselves? 
there's no uh, there's no ending speech. But we're gonna find out exactly what happens in the next video. Hope you guys enjoyed, it, and I'll see you guys next time. Hello everyone, this is HDS Gesky here, picking up right where we left off with some more blur, 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 Brood War playthrough action. I'm actually still on the same screen, so let's go ahead and continue on through. Let's see what they have to say. Return to Char. Protoss fleet, high orbit, over the planet Char. Executor, the Urash is secured, and the UED has given up the chase. We are currently holding perimeter orbit over the planet Char. Zeratul? Have you locked onto the location of the Callus? Yes. I remember sensing his power the last time I was on this world. However, our sensors indicate a massive, fluctuating energy signature at its location. I am, however, unable to identify the signature's source. That should be obvious, gentlemen. The source is the Overmind itself. When the Cerebrates merged together, they must have locked onto the Callus energies and nested near it. It's probable that there will be a number of broods protecting that area. It's risky, but if we can strike hard and fast, we might be able to fight our way through their defenses and escape with the crystal. Comrades, I may have an alternative. Seeing as how the Overmind is still in its infant stages, I wonder if we might be able to disrupt its control over those broods. If we can do enough superficial damage to the creature, it might pacify the Zerg nearest to it, allowing us some time to retrieve the Callus. A bold plan, young Artanis. Your courage rivals that of mighty Tazadar himself. You give me too much credit, noble Zeratul. I am not worthy enough to even speak his name. Touching. Look, boys, either of these plans will work, but let's not waste any time. I'll be able to exert limited control over a few of the Zerg here and provide you with some backup. But the longer we stay, the more we risk losing both the crystals again. Agreed. Executor, deploy your forces. May our doom be with you. I don't trust Kerrigan. I don't know how many times I've had to say that. Oh, God. It wants me to play as both races. This should be interesting. This should definitely, definitely, definitely be interesting. All right, we'll see if we can figure this out. Um, I think I should go for gas right away, so we're going to go ahead and do that. We're going to go ahead and build that extractor. Get it going as quickly as possible. And we have an observer over here. It has spotted another expansion for us already. And probe count. Let's get this rolling right away. There's a lot of minerals over here. Actually, there's a lot of money in general. What, uh, what units can I make? Hydralis, Mutalisks. Um, should I build another hatchery? Or is this ample enough? Are these bases connected? Yes, they are. They are indeed connected. Yeah, oh god, lurkers. Oh dear. Oh dear. I wonder if Mutalisks are the way to go. I'm going to build another hatchery. I don't know exactly where this should go, but... Uh... Go there, should go here. We're gonna put it here. Get that on the way. Oh god, this is gonna be so confusing. My brain is already like, oh, trying to remember two races, can't do it. I wonder if going mass muta. Do you think do you think mass muta would work on this? I wanna say yes. I'm inclined to say yes. I'm also inclined to try and figure out how easy that expansion is to get. So we are about to find out. I'm gonna build that sunken. Get that sunken. This one should probably be a score, yeah? Alright, let's get the gas rolling. Well, I need four guys in there, you think? Yeah, let's try four. Oh, God. Oh, it's happening already. This game's getting right out of the way. Don't you dare kill my cannon. Don't you. Oh, you stupid jerk holes. Alright, well, we're just building this for the sake of the gas, so. Can I get a layer tech already? Yep, layer tech on the way. Wait, is that a gas? No, oh, it's a fake one. They threw me off. They threw me for a loop. That's not cool. That is not cool one bit. Is that a rally point set? Nope, this guy's happened to spawn in a weird spot. Alright, so it is definitely going to be mass muta time. We're going to have three bases. I'm feeling pretty good about this. 
Yeah, we're mostly just fighting Zerg, so this should go okay. Maybe. Maybe let's uh, put this over here. Drones. Oh, what are you guys doing? Get over there. I don't really need that many drones over here. I can actually... I think I should transfer some of these guys over. Pretty soon, anyway. Pro Pro. And I do need some overlords. Spire should be almost done. Are the uh, players back? All right, time for a spire. Hopefully this works. Yeah, got. I'm on it. I'm on it. Probably gonna need some pylons here too. Build pylon. You guys go over there. All right. Drones and probes, you gotta, you gotta get along. That's just how it is. I'm not missing any gas, right? Like it's not completely obvious or something. All right, so this is now done, so that's nice. You guys should actually probably come mine down here. You are much needed in the area. More probes. Also more pylons. All right. Oh God. Oh, I need to build an extractor. What's happening? What's happening? Oh, army! Army, what are you doing? What are you doing, drones? Come up here. Not my overlord. What are you doing? Leave my poor overlord alone. Alright, took care of that. If I ever have to deal with these stupid lurkers, though, I'm going to be super not happy. Hey! Hey! Oh, God, they have a lot of anti-air, though. I don't know if this plan was the best plan. That I could have had. But screw it, we're gonna do it anyways. We're gonna make this work. I also need double upgrades. Although, no, no, because I can only get one one on these right now, huh? Alright, so there's that. All more drones. You guys should all get to work. Looks like the income's gonna be pretty good. So that's nice. We got the Zerglings. Very nice. You should, let's just build a cannon, a couple cannons down here. Just to be safe. And let's just hope Mass Muta is the way to victory. Oh my god, I forgot about Protoss shield batteries, man. They recharge your shields on your units and, I think buildings maybe. If it's within range or something silly, I don't know. Alright, so we're going to be setting a rally point here. Here. And here. And we are just hoping with our fingers and toes crossed that we are going to be able to get enough gas to make this many, this many mutalisks. And hopefully we can get enough mutalisks to just straight up win the game. We'll see. I mean, I do have a lot of extra minerals. My main concern. Let's just, uh, let's just send a probe out. Maybe, maybe you'll have a chance. Maybe you'll have a chance of making it there. How do you do? Oh, dodge it. Dodge it. You did okay. You didn't do bad. Wasn't the greatest. I'll give him that. But uh, either way, looks like there's a base up here, relatively undefended. Let's see what I can do with these. Let's see what I can do with my mutas. Uh, muta. Muta. Yeah, get out of here, lurkers. How do you like me now? How you like me now, lurkers? All right, we're gonna try to see what they have, to see what their uh, anti-air situation is. Go ahead and bait away this hydro. And, oh, kill that one. So we're gonna back up first. While we make some more. I was make some overlord to be safe. What is this? What does this overlord think he's doing? All right, take that out. We got this hydra. And we're gonna go straight for that score. Kill it! Kill it! No, we actually lost the Muta! Hope my attack upgrade is done soon. No, I lost another Muta! This is not going according to plan, there's so many Hydralisks. Oh god, there's even Scourge. Quick, kill the Scourge! Don't let him hit you! No! We've lost three! We've lost a lot of good men today. There's that. Yeah, good 
Good job, Cannon. All right, there's Control 1. Put you guys over there. Control 2. Do I have more Meatless on the way? Anywhere? Anybody? I should just make, like, Zell Strength just to have them. All right, well, we definitely pissed off their Hydra, so that's actually good, because they're just running into our cannon. Our cannons of death. And that upgrade's probably done, right? Oh, it does let us get more upgrades. All right, there's Control 2. Right, I'm feeling good. I'm feeling good about these. Definitely need to work on... Oh, my God, 225? Jeez. We're going to build another Spire. We're going to get upgrades going. All right, let's try this. One and two. And screw it. We can even start a control group three, man. Go, go, Mutalisks. You're not going to get the chance to use Zerg units very often, so might as well enjoy it while we can. All right, let's, uh, let's come up here. There we go. All right, yeah, kill this off. And that might actually do it for this base. Definitely need some more Munas. Yes, Munas are the way to go. They are the way to go. I kind of want to kill off these three things, though. So I can kind of expand there. Actually, I can't expand there. What am I talking about? Because I'm Zerg. It don't matter if there's a creep or not. All right, saving up for the other upgrades. Kill this. I doubt they're only hydro stand, but let's just try. Hopefully, it'll slow the hydro production at any rate. What is this? Oh god, my zergling! Are my drone? Get out of there, drone! Get out of there, no! No, how could you? How could you do this to me? I actually have to use this observer now. Well, it definitely has not slowed down the amount of hydro they're throwing at me. That's for sure. Alright, where's that observer? Come here. Come up here. Any more, any more drones or zerglings on the road down here? Alright, let's uh, let's send over a drone. Wow, really? Really gonna use that queen slow stuff on me? God, there's so many hydras. I definitely need to start this upgrade though. Mutas. As long as the upgrades are good, I feel like uh, I feel like you're gonna be the way to go. Right, we're gonna go ahead and put that there. Nope, don't you dare! Don't you dare! All right, we lost uh, we lost a couple of guys. There we go. We should have some more on the way. Control three. There we go. Now, the question is, do I want to go for the crystal, or do I want to go for the overmind? I honestly have no idea. Yes, work on the upgrade. Upgrade's looking good. Oh, what is this? What did we run into? Let's, uh, let's maybe not, maybe not suicide like that. That would be great. All right, control one. Control group three needs that one. What? What? Are you serious? We gotta protect us with our links or something. Oh god. Oh god, that's a lot of hydras. Back it up. Back it up. I know upgrades are done soon. We need to make the blows. Alright, Zerglings, you've got this. Alright, you guys come over here. Come kill that. You set your rally point over there. Cause I need more gas, yo. That's all there is to it. That's all there is to it. End of discussion. All right, so we're gonna go ahead and build. Well, let's get the extractor going. And get the drone. Should have some drones on the way. This uh, this group of guys though is looking pretty awesome. 
guys. You're actually going to be control group number four at this point. So there's that. Pretty freaking awesome. Yes, I have a lot of minerals, guys. You don't, you don't need to remind me. I just want to make sure I can defend this. You three are going to go in there. All right, we are almost ready. We are almost there. Because we're going to have some defenses up here so they can't attack my base. All right, I think we're ready. I think we are ready. Oh, give me these. Give me these. The fresh recruits have arrived. Oh, you, you came on the wrong side of town, Zerglings. You are on the wrong side of the town. One, two, three, four. Here we go. We're going to go for it. We're going to do it. We got this. Oh, my God. That's so much anti-air. That is so much anti-air. Oh, my God. We can do it. We're going we're gonna to power through. We are going to power through. I'm not even, even going to watch. You guys are on your own. I can't even watch this. Sunken. Sunken. Oh, why? Why is it so much anti-air? It's almost as if they're trying to make you not do this strategy. But I'm going to do it anyways, man. I'm going to make this work. Ow, so many Scourge. So many Scourge. Kill the Spire. All right, back up. Everybody out of there. Jeez. I just lost so much during that. I think I only have one control group left. All right, well, we have the extra gas income, so we can replenish those. You guys, I guess, just mind this. Not that it even matters at this point. Oh, we do have some guys over here. Very nice. Let's uh, let's just see what happens if I send... No, that's not going to end well, is it? That is not going to end well, no matter how you cut it. All right, control group two. Where do you guys think you're going? Where you guys are on key group number three. All right, hopefully they aren't allowed to rebuild on that ledge. That would make me a very sad panda. That would make me a very, very, very sad panda. Okay, control group three. But he's got the macro a little bit. You guys can transfer over here. I don't know that we need to be killing this right now. I feel like we do not have the guys to spare for this. I don't even know where these rally points are set anymore. All right, but we got three control groups. That's my magic number. So we're gonna try this. Here we go. Here we go, maximum power. Maximum power right here. Up, oh, come up here. All right, one, two, three. Good luck. Good luck, you're going to need it. Oh my God, that's an ultralisk. It's fine, we killed it. You guys are coming down here too. It's not too late to join the party. It's not too late to join the party. Oh, but there's so much anti-air. So much anti-air. Jeez. I'm going to actually lose all these guys. I think I'm going to. It's time to leave. Time to leave. This is not the way to go, man. This is, this is not the way to do it. Although we did, uh, we did actually break... A little bit of a hole in their defense. God, that is so many. All right, let's kill this off. Maybe, there, maybe by some weird stroke of luck, it is our last Hydralisk then. All right, kill this Hydra. And kill, just kill the Hydra dead, gosh darn it. All right, we killed the Hydra den. We can feel good about ourselves. All right, you go there. Go there. Go there. Got any beetles floating around here? Require more Vespine gas. All right. Maybe the plan should be lots of zerglings. 
All right, we're down to one hot key group again. Let's just send this guy out. Let's just see what he finds. All right, there's that. And you guys are control group number two. Congratulations. You guys are control group number three. The warriors have engaged the enemy required or best being gas. Don't worry, DT, you're going to be fine. Everything is going to be fine. Alright, so you guys are also control group number three. I have 10,000 minerals. So we gotta we gotta fix this problem. We gotta we gotta definitely fix. Come on, Jordan, get out of the way. What what is this? Come on, go deal with that. Build hatchery. Build hatchery. Build hatchery and another hatchery. One. Okay, you guys come up here. You guys can control group number three. And you, congratulations, are control group number four. I'm not going until I have four control groups full of freaking units. Also, I have Zerg in speed, yes? I hope so. I think so. Oh, no, I don't. That's gonna be, that's gonna be my backup plan. There's lots of Zerg wings. Alright, more Muta's on the way. Muta's all day, every day. It's the only option. There is no other way to beat this map, and that's what I'm telling myself. Alright, these are almost done. My master plan has almost hatched. Quite literally. Alright, control four. And your control group four, almost there. Oh god, here they come. Make the links, make all the links. Well, I think it's actually gonna be okay. As long as I have and also I researched over the speed. Alright. Alright, this if this isn't enough, there's no such thing as enough needless for this mission. Yeah, you better get out of here, you stupid lurker. Alright, are you guys ready for this madness? I sure as hell am. This is madness! Here we go. One, two, three. One, two, no, kill this one. Alright, kill this one. Focus that fire. Focus fire, there's so much stuff. Kill the, uh, kill the scourge. Kill this one. Kill this one. Kill this one. You guys can do it. You guys can do it, I believe. I believe. Greg, keep going. You must keep pushing. You also must make more beetlisks. Oh my god, they seriously have got so much anti-air that it has hit absurdity. Oh my god, we actually we actually we actually did it! We have made it! Oh god. Alright, alright, well we may have made it, but it's probably time to go now. I still have somehow saved 12 of these. This? What is with these ultras? Why are these all of a sudden a threat? Alright, so we got that. Now we just gotta get overlord drops. Alright, not bad. Nope, that's bad. You don't want to go there. Alright, so, you guys plan is to push down here. As much as possible. Oh god, they finally got some upgrades going. Alright. Kill off all this stuff. Zerglings, I'm counting on you. Do not run into any lurkers, okay? And if you do, there's an overlord. But other than that, you're on your own. Go, go, Zerglings, you've got this. 
You have absolutely got this. No Oh god, there's those lurkers. There's those lurkers we were talking about. Don't worry, that lurker only killed 15 of you guys. And I think we're just waiting on the floor drops right now, yes? More zerglings go! Ah, there's also more lurkers though. Lurkers definitely make this tough. Come on, Overlord, you can do it. Save the day, Overlord. No! No! Oh, God. Well, that didn't work out so well. Alright, there it is. There it is. We just need a probe. All of you guys just go mine up here. And I don't even know which Overlord has it. Wait, we actually didn't. There it is. All right, you guys, come this way. Come with me if you want to die. All right, let's see if I can be sneaky about this. Nope. Oh, yep, I can, actually. Oh, no, the Overlord. The Overlord is onto me. But guess what? I'm onto your crystal. I'm onto your callous crystal. And I have no regrets. I may have sacrificed all of Kerrigan's units, but I don't trust her anyway. You should never trust Kerrigan. The first rule of intergalactic combat is do not trust Kerrigan. Oh, uh, you better not lose. Whichever Overlord has the, the probity, you die. If you die, then you're all fired. You are all fired. I don't even know if there's anything over here, but I'm just gonna check. Alright, one of you should. There we go. The callus is ours. Let us depart this wretched world and return to Shakuras. Provided there is still a Shakuras to return to. Alright, well played, enemy Zerg spore crawlers. Not spore crawlers. Uh, spore colonies. God, it is so hard not to get these two games confused. But anyways, what a ridiculously long game. Hope you guys enjoyed it. And of course, I'll see you guys next time. Hello everyone, this is HTS Cask here, back with some more Brood War playthrough action. We're just going to pick up right where we left off. I took a couple of a day break, and we're back now with the Insurgent. And we are at Executor Citadel at New Antioch on Shakuris. Congratulations, Executor. Your success has brought us the promise of hope against the Zerg. However, we face a new threat within our own ranks. In your absence... Judicator Alderis and an entire legion of Kali survivors from Ayer have begun an open revolt against us. By the gods, this is ill news indeed. Why would Alderis betray us so? He and his ilk believe that it was wrong to have abandoned Ayer and consorted with our people. Their prejudices have driven them to perpetuate the Conclave's sins against us. Even now, Alderis and his Loyalist Templar forces are preparing to attack our Citadel. I can scarcely believe this. As if the Zerg were not enough. Matriarch, are you certain of this? All too certain, young Templar. Executor, as Matriarch of the Dark Templar and custodian of this world, I hereby order you to terminate Judicator Alderis and quell this untimely uprising without delay. There will be no dissent among us while the Zerg are poised to strike. There's something amiss here. The Matriarch has always been a wise and gentle soul. Though there is some merit in her decision, this is very unlike her. That may well be. But right now, we have a friend to kill. May I do forgive us? You know, I, I told you guys it's a bad idea to be dealing with Kerrigan. I, what did I say? God, I should be the, uh, the leader. Mr. Executor, our forces are divided. Alsderis has taken control of our Templar warriors and arbiters. It is possible that he may even send Archons against us. Fear not, comrades, for we have Archons of our own. Should the dire need arise, all Dark Templar may merge to become Dark Archons. Though we sacrifice our warriors in doing so, only the might of the Dark Archons can match the forces of Aldaris. 
All right, well, uh, we apparently have Dark Archons now. Oh, there's an expansion up here as well. I should probably put these guys down to work. And uh, I told him, I said 100 times, do not work with Kerrigan, and this is what happens. So, uh, I, not to say I told you so, but I kind of told you so. I'm totally mind controlling this thing, man. Come with me, Kakaroo. You are now pro part of the Protoss fleet. Now let's go find something else to mind control because mind control is awesome, and I'm so glad they added it. And there we go. Just get these guys going. Wait, wait. Where's my other? Where's my other Archon? There he is. All right, Kakaroo. You go scout. I don't know if they'll kill you or not, but let's go find out. We can uh, we can scout with our awesome Kakaroo. And don't worry. Oh dear. Nope. We're gonna take that. Thank you. We're coming back. Nope. Just go ahead and leave him. Oh no. They know. How do they know? Oh dear. All right. At least I got a uh, an Archon out of this. All right, time for some more Probus. There we go. We just gotta get a lot of these guys going, and then I'm gonna expand right away. Hey, hey, that's not cool. That's not cool. What does Dragoon ever do to you? All right, here we go. We can we can use these guys. Yep, you back up. No, don't let them kill the cannon. Don't let them kill the cannon. They do so much damage. All right, there's that. And I think we're actually off to a pretty good start here, man. We got uh, we got our base going. I'm gonna go ahead and expand right away. Just because this base up here is awesome, we mind controlled a, a an archon, which is pretty sweet, if you ask me. Let's go ahead and back this guy up as well. Yeah, it's cool that you guys are on the high ground, but at the same time, I don't know. I just don't know. Um, so did they take away High Templar? Yes, they did. That is not cool, man. He took all our High Templar and our Arbiters. So uncool. So uncool. But can. I make a Stargate. Yes, I can. Oh, it's totally time for Stargate. And why are all these probes stuck down here? Why don't you guys come mine up here? What are you doing? Come on, probe AI. Work with me here. You got you to gotta work with me here. All right, you need to build a Nexus right there. And we're also going to build a pylon right over here. We're going to secure that expansion right away. We got our hotkey group of guys. And, yeah, we'll just keep making probes here for a little bit. Uh, it's such a weird place for a cannon, but I will take it. And Alderis, no, I don't want to kill you. Oh, God, which one's the real Alderis? I don't actually know. I'm going to assume the one on the top left side, but we'll see. We shall see. And Stargate on the way. Do I have a forge? Yes, I do. So I'm going to build a cannon right here. Just get that started. I should also start the upgrades just because they'd be so good. And this is gonna be hotkey number three. You guys go down here. Saturation's looking pretty good. I definitely need to get more guys up there. And time for a fleet beacon. Come on, baby. Oh God, they cost 300 Gs. 300 minerals, but this, then again, carriers were actually good back then. So we're gonna go ahead and use those. I'm assuming that this is almost done. Yep, we can start transferring over you guys. This may be a little bit overkill, but whatever. Whatever, we gotta we gotta get probes up here quickly before they attack it. And get the crazy split going. You may say this isn't actually worth it, but it is. But it is. Oh, we gotta come up here. Need more cannons. Need more cannons. Spawn more cannons. Zelts are so good. Thankfully, this Dragoon is extremely stupid. No, he killed it. That is so not cool. That's because they have the 1-1 upgrades. Should I mind control something? Sure. Take the Dragoon. My Dragoon now, baby. It's kind of awesome that they already give you uh, mind control research. Just got to say that that is pretty freaking cool. Okay. So, yes, we may have sent too many guys up here. That's fine. It's going to be fine. Why do I have so many probes just chilling out? What's going on, guys? All right. We got to work on the interceptors. Wait. Maybe. Do I not get that upgrade yet? Let's find out. Usually, you have to get an upgrade to uh, increase the interceptor capacity, but maybe... Maybe it just doesn't exist anymore. All right, so you're going to come over here, and we definitely need a cannon. And I'm wondering, I'm wondering what kind of units will be up here, and should I make, uh, let's work on these upgrades. I, I feel like, I feel like, uh, what is the Cybernex Core hotkey? Why? There's that. I feel like getting getting carriers is going to be the way to go. But I'm also worried that they're not going to have the awesome upgrades that I need. So that is also a big concern of mine. You guys are going to go over there. You come up here. That guy is done. Making cannons. And our army is looking good. Okay, so we got our macro. Now we got to work on the army. Let's, uh, let's build another Stargate here. 
Let's get one of those going. Just because carriers are amazing and carriers have indeed arrived. And Operation Save the Carrier, a complete success for Hearth Swarm, I'd like to say, at least so far. What? More pylons? I thought I was. All right, we'll build another one. Actually, we'll build, we'll build lots of pylons up here. You shall never unpower my cannons. Let's, let's put one cannon here. Just to, uh, just to help out with defense. Because there's a lot of money up here. There's also an expansion over there. So, carrier. Looking good. Get the armor upgrade. We got the plus attack. And what I should do is actually go for the shield upgrade. Making everything uh, much, much better. Alright, you guys just keep making probes. I'm just queuing up a bunch of probes because I'm going to need a lot. Now, should I make more Archons? Because Archons are pretty sweet. And maybe I can only make four. Oh, it does already give me the upgrade. That's weird. I wonder, why they, uh, wonder why they did it that way. Either way, I'm not going to complain. Free upgrades, man. I will take it. Time for some more pylons. There's one. And come on, probe. Come on, you can make it through there. Not enough minerals. Not enough minerals. Shush! Build pylon. Build more pylons. We got we to gotta throw these pylons down like crazy because carriers are pretty freaking good, man. They are so, so good in this game. All right, we got the upgrades going. You guys over there. Carrier's looking good. You have to individually build these interceptors, but that's fine. That's fine. It's a small price to pay for a super good unit. And we're just gonna, we're just basically gonna macro here for a little bit. Oh, my stupid smoke alarm. Randomly beeping. Obviously, someone's cooking something in the kitchen. That's, uh, that's how I cook anyways. The, the good old, oh, oh, we need to get down here. That poor cannon is so done. So, so done. Actually, let's leave hockey group up here just in case. Hockey group number two. You need to come up here. And I don't, oh, can I mind control this? Yes, take the Reaver. Yes, Reaver for the win. Reaver for the win. And thank goodness these guys actually recharged their, uh, their casting energy pretty quick, I feel like. Okay, now, now our macro is really rolling. So we gotta, we gotta throw down another one of these. I feel like pretty soon I should try to expand, but I don't know. Reaver, 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 Reaver. All right, so. We got carrier right there. Second carrier has arrived. Carrier has arrived. All right, is there someone idle? There he is. You're supposed to be building pylons, buddy. We are gonna get maxed out so quickly. And let's uh, let's go ahead and build a cannon here. And while I'm away, let's just go ahead and build a cannon there. I wonder if I build that and hold shift and go there. Will he build both or just one? I think just one. All right, so cannons. That's where you're going at. Also need some more pylons. And I don't think I'll need a fourth Stargate. Although maybe, because these carriers build so slowly. It's actually absurd how slowly they build. All right, you guys come over here. Looking good. Hotkey group number two. And this, you are the new hotkey group number three because carriers, carriers are awesome. Maybe I should build another Stargate because the income is actually absurd right now. Screw it, I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna do it. Bam and bam. And more upgrades. Get these started at the exact same time. Oh, yeah. With double upgrades, I don't think I can afford three three Stargates. Plus, I got to get the shield upgrades. It's actually pretty useful. Uh, let's see. More Vespine gas. No. I guess I can make some Zealots to go along. To tag along for the ride. All right, let's go ahead and throw some more gateways down. We can do that. Do I have Zealot legs? No. No, I don't. I really want to get the shield upgrades, so I'm going to save up for that. All right, buddy, your job is to build gateways. Give me the more gateways. Hey, your job is also to build gateways. If you got time to lean, you got time to warp in gateways. All right, let's see. There's that. And I have four carriers now. Five carriers now. I'm getting pretty excited about this. I have, I have missed carriers a great deal. I think we all have. Oh, how we have all missed carriers. I kind of want to get the shield upgrade, but at the same time, I want another carrier. Choices. I must expand soon. Maybe I should put another guy in gas. Can't tell if that's maxed or not. All right, there's another carrier. One, two, three. And we're just going to work on some zealots to add to hotkey groups. See, let's get some carriers over here. You, wait, wait, wait. There you go. All right, time for some zealots. Lots and lots of zealots, actually. All right, so there's that. I should definitely work on the zealot legs upgrade, though. It is so good in StarCraft 2, or StarCraft 1. It's also good in StarCraft 2. And there's hockey group number one. Three just added a carrier to its ranks. Pretty soon, we're gonna have, we're gonna have maxed out army here. Uh, let's see, you guys need to be 
part of hotkey group number two. Yes. I lie for ire. I lie for ire. Yes. All right, so there we go. Now we're talking. Now we're looking pretty terrifying. Mostly it's just the carriers, though. Definitely mostly just the carriers. But we're still making some zealots because why not? You need a hotkey down there. Rally point set. You have to individually do that. And more pylons. We're going to be maxed out pretty soon, actually. i gotta, I got to save a little bit of money for an expansion. And let's see. That should be all the pylons I need. One, two. Oh no, I messed up the hotkeys. All right, hotkey group one over here. Quick, go save the expansion. Oh my god, they kill myself so quickly. Those stupid one-one upgrades. All right, you guys are hotkey group number three. That's how we're gonna do it. Hotkey group number three, and number two is going to be you guys. And I guess number four is going to be these guys. All right, there we go. There we go. Take him out. Oh, no, I should have sent these guys to mind control. Oh, well. Zealots. No, not the Reaver. Actually, the Reaver's, the Reaver's being smart, man. He's attacking them so far away. Oh, man, they they decimated my number one force group. All right, you know what? We're going we're gonna to come over here, and then let's see who we have to add. Have we, have we made replacement Zealots yet? Not yet. But we do have another carrier. And honestly, that's uh, that's all I care about. If everyone else dies, at least we have the carriers. I feel like I'm focused on the important things in life. You have not, enough minerals. not enough minerals. That's a bunch of bull. Yes, another carrier. Interceptors do add up, but they are totally worth it. All right, we got some zealots on the way. Another carrier. I hope you guys are almost ready for this. Does zealot legs yet? Yes, I do. Yes, I do, baby. All right, so. My first mission is to push towards that expansion. And we'll see. I have a pretty good amount of forces now. So I should be A-OK. -okay. More carriers. Oh, I already have carriers on the way. So time for some zealots. One, two, three, four. All right, four hotkey groups right now. All right, you guys ready for this? You guys ready for this? Enough macroing around. It's time to kill some Protoss. All right, you guys go that way. And we're just going to keep making carriers, I guess. Wait, wait, shield upgrade. Oh, I also need these upgrades, huh? All right, give me that. All right, here we go. Carriers, ho! Except these guys got to be careful. Any any awesome things I can mind control? Don't really want to mind control a scout. That's kind of, that's definitely a waste. Scouts are good anti-air, but not, not a whole lot else. God, these things cost a lot. Oh, hi, Templar. You're mine. You are mine, High Templar! This game doesn't want me to use High Templar on this map. Yes, Psy Storm, baby. Hey, look, I lost someone to this group, so now uh, now you're gonna fit right in. Plus, I have Psy Storm, so I'm pretty excited about it. Oh god, I'm like maxed out. I am totally maxed out. All right, give me that. All right, Control 3. All right, even more carriers on the way. Anyone to add to Control Group number 4? Yep. Oh, I do have a full hockey group. A full hockey group. You want to add to control group number four? Yep. Oh, I do have a full hockey group. A full hockey group of carriers. I have not done this in so many years because carriers are bad in StarCraft 2. All right, you guys, you guys can figure out the bridge. I have faith. God, carriers can attack from so far away. Jeez, that's like Broodlord range, man. So awesome. All right, hockey one, two, three, uh, four. Hopefully you guys, hopefully you can make it across the bridge. I know it's tough. I know it's a tough, uh, tough challenge. And I know that we're also upgrade, up, out upgraded. But let's, uh, I guess we're working on the shield upgrades. That's not bad. I think I have enough for another carrier. Anything I should be mind controlling? Uh oh, did I lose one of these guys? I think that I did. I think, oh, wait, wait, he's still somewhere. Nope, that's that one. Where are you, buddy? You're right in the thick of things. Quick, mind control it before it dies. Yes. Oh, I should have took it the Arbiter. No! Arbiters are so awesome. Oh god. We gotta we gotta kill this Arbiter actually. Because he's gotta be cloaking everything. Alright, kill the Arbiter because I can't mind control them, fortunately. But that would have been absolutely sweet. Let's uh, let's just make more and more carriers. I feel like that's the secret. The secret is more carriers and also expanding. Oh god, I actually lost a lot of stuff there. None of my carriers though, so that's nice. Wait, killer carrier, what are you doing? Uh oh, oh, watch out for the storm. Watch out for the storm. A storm is coming. 
Brace yourselves. All right, go kill that. Can I, do, I, do any of you have enough energy for mind control? Uh, he almost does, but not quite. All right, kill their carrier. Don't let them, don't let them get 12 carriers. And yeah, just, we're just gonna make carriers. We're just gonna fill the supply with carriers, but of course more zealots as well. Because I have lots of money, so I might as well. And you should build a nexus right here. You should also build. Oh god, did I lose my entire control group? Yeah, I lost everything except for my carriers. That is crazy. But carriers are uh, a pretty good unit to have, so might as well, might as well keep doing it. Let's go ahead and secure this location. Don't worry, Zelts. I uh, I didn't kill off all your brethren. They will uh, they will return in the afterlife as their dragoons. So that was that, that was my plan all along. Yes. I didn't think I'd be caught so easily, did you, Executor? You have only destroyed a phantom. Oh no, a phantom, a spooky phantom. All right, well, cares. You know what? You're the new you're the new hotkey group number one because you guys are crushing it. And you guys can be hotkey group number two, because you will soon crush it. You go up there, and I guess we just we just keep making the carriers at this point. And are you guys running low on money? Who should I transfer? Who should I transfer some of you guys over here? And yep, more interceptors. More carriers. I guess I did build a lot of zealots. Oh, I'm supply max. Alright, you guys. Operation. Don't worry, you'll survive. It's going to be fine. Even though you have no anti-air, is now underway. All right, kill this guy off. Oh no, I lost a carrier. Not cool. We should come down here and kill these, just so. Oh god, this reaver. This. Oh, that's gonna hurt. Ow! Kill the reaver. Kill the reaver. Kill it. All right, before we got another shot off, at least. And carrier. Oh, carrier, carrier. More interceptors. And you know what? I should even just expand over here just to, just to make sure I have a lot of backup income. Although you guys are actually doing pretty good. You should you should definitely come over here though. Don't worry, Zelts, you've got this! You've got this! You are Ayer's savior. It's definitely not the carriers that I'm favoring right now. And how's the carriers looking? Not bad, not bad. Interceptors. Yes, Zealots! This is all you! This is all you! Maybe, maybe I should give some some upgrades. I feel kind of bad. At least they are killing something, at least. Like, working out those cannons. And, I mean, I, now I'm remembering how I did this as a kid, man. Just make lots and lots of carriers with all your gas. Use the rest on Zealots, and you are pretty much good to go. Carrier, carrier, and another carrier. I am, I'm assuming the one up north is nearly a phantom. There we go. Take those out. You guys, you guys aren't done yet. You gotta take out more cannons. Zealots. Oh, actually, I'm kind of low on money. So, we should definitely expand right here. We should definitely bring a lot of these guys up here. Oh, we should bring, like, all these guys. You know what? Just, just go all the way over here. The farthest away mineral patch, because there's a lot of mineral patches here, so... So have fun over there. Anyone else want to be added? There you go, there you go. Give me some more interceptors going, and look at the minimap. Look at how crazy interceptors are. Especially when they're 3-3. They just do a ridiculous amount of damage. Alright, so this expansion's up and running. We got tons of probes coming over here. You can go ahead and mine, why not? And now we're just gonna swing out through, killing off all the buildings because I love killing things. I love killing things, which is uh, definitely, definitely could be taken out of context if I was running for president. Husky Starcraft, aka Mike Lamont, loves killing things. Do you want a president who loves killing things? Uh, yeah, yeah. I mean, if if, if it's if it's Zerg bugs, man, I hate. Uh, I definitely hate Zerg. So. I am all for a president who is for killing the Zerg. I think we definitely should not. I mean, a relaxed, uh, a relaxed Zerg strategy when it comes to how to deal with Zerg is not a, not a good one. That's not very presidential. Oh. Here we go. Looks like we found the real one. Finished, Judicator. 
Surrender your remaining forces, and join us in eradicating the Zerg. I would sooner die, Darkwan, than tarnish the memory of Ayer by joining with you. Your fate was sealed the moment your matriarch allied herself with the Queen of Blades. Those of us still loyal to Aya will never be slaves to Kerrigan and her broods. Alteris, be reasonable. Kerrigan has changed. She no longer seeks to enslave anyone. Do not force us to destroy you. You can no longer afford to be so naive, Artanis. While you were securing the crystals, I discovered that your matriarch has been harboring a dark secret. She has been manipulated we by have this- have no time for this. Kerrigan, oh, what have you done? I just cleaned up your mess, Protoss. Don't be so squeamish. Wretched creature. This was a Protoss matter. You had no right to interfere. Be gone from this world. You are no longer welcome among us. Fine. I've done what I came here to do. I've ensured the destruction of the renegade Cerebrates, and I used you to do it. Have fun, mighty Protoss. We'll be seeing each other again real soon. Well, that's a shocker. Kerrigan backstabbed you. Oh, I wonder... Oh, wait, she's killed billions of people. Uh, sometimes, sometimes the Protoss... They, you, you love them, but at the same time, you just gotta hate them. Alright, so we just got backstabbed by Kerrigan, as is to be expected, because she's a jerkhead. And we're gonna continue on, see exactly how we clean this mess up. Hope you guys enjoy it, and I'll see you guys next time! Hello everyone, this is HTSKS here, back some more Brood War playthrough action. We got totally screwed over by Kerrigan, as per usual. So we're gonna continue with the countdown. Main Protoss base, the planet of Shakuras. This entire chain of events has been masterminded by Kerrigan, and we played right into her hands. Yes, we did, Artemis. Yet our course is set, nonetheless. Using the Temple's energies against the Renegade Zerg may accomplish Kerrigan's aims, but it is still our only chance of survival. And survive we will, my warriors. For too long have we labored in futile defense, as our enemies push us further and further away from victory. The time has come to let loose the full fury of our powers. Never again shall Shakuras be despoiled by the foul touch of alien species. These Zerg shall be the first to fall before us. Matriarch, I have served you for many millennia. I have always valued your wisdom and strength, yet, lately, in your mind, I have sensed something that clouds your true spirit. Though Kerrigan has gone, I wonder if her treachery still remains. Be at ease, Zeratul. I am still the same Rashagal you have always known. These recent events have weighed heavily upon me, and I am wearied. But fear not. My warrior spirit will shine before you and light your path to victory. Indeed. The time for action is upon us. The crystals must be taken to the temple while the Zerg still muster their forces. I shall carry the Urash myself, while Zeratul handles the callus. Executor. You shall provide escort for Artanis and Zeratul as they make their way to the temple. God's willing, we will channel the energies of the Zelnaga and scour this world clean of the Zerg. Go now, my children, and know that the survival of our entire race depends upon your actions. Alright, I mean, uh, no, no pressure or anything. When you bring the crystals to the temple, the Zerg will surely send all their legions to destroy you. You must be prepared to protect the temple itself from the swarm. I concur. All right, so I guess uh, we're doing a we're doing a two base system here today. So just go ahead and get that started. We're gonna get the gas started right away as well as 
Come on, there we go. I don't know what it was uh, so difficult about putting that guy down. I'd like to get upgrades going right as well. Um, should I go for carriers? Let's screw it. Let's go for let's uh, let's go for more air units. There's that. They never hurt. We're gonna get lots of upgrades going. And you're over there. We gotta switch back and forth between these two bases. Is there a gas up here, or is this just minerals? Uh, just minerals. Just minerals. It would appear. I am ready. Maybe you guys should be over here. More probes. Yep, let's get these guys on gas. Maybe even a fourth? I don't know if that's as close as it needs to be. But gas is definitely going to be the issue, because we do have two bases that are minerals, but only one base that has gas. Let's just let's just scout around a little bit. Just see what Zeratul has to say about this. I do this for Aya. All right, get more upgrades. We're getting those right away, baby. We're, we're gonna try to rush to carriers. I don't know if that's actually the best choice. Because in the last game I had uh, I had mind control essentially. That just let me mind control an entire army. But we don't have that luxury here today. All right, so we got that going. Let's, uh, let's keep moving around with Zero Tool. I'm kind of curious to see exactly what is on the map. Because this, like, this is not like StarCraft II. You do not get a preview what is uh, what is around the corner. You gotta scout it out yourself. All right, so that's a big dead end. Oh, what's this? What's this? Just circling, back it up. Oh, it's not just Zerglings. Oh god, where are you? Get up here, buddy. We need you. Alright, you can do it. You can do it, Dragoons. Bait him back. Bait him back. No, he's out of position. He's so out of position. Oh, this is a, this is a sad, sad day for Protoss. This is a very sad day for Protoss. Alright, so there's that. Let's, uh, let's maybe work on a Stargate here. I yes, need the Stargate of some sort. And you guys go down there. Lots more probes. I'm kind of sad that I lost those about the same time. I probably should have been scouting around with Zero Tool. As fun as it is, it's probably not for the best. Alright, so there's that. Starting to mine here pretty good. Starting to mine here pretty good. Upgrades are pretty good. Stargates are pretty good. I kind of want to get the uh, the Templar tech too, just because, just because Templar are pretty amazing. There's that. I wonder if I should build down here because there's really no no way for Zerg to attack them unless they drop. So we'll see. We'll see. Man, these upgrades are pretty quick. It feels like. There's the Stargate. Now it's time for a fleet beacon. Gotta get that going right away. I can't remember what the plus two upgrade requires. I don't remember if it requires a uh, fleet beacon or not. Let's get that started. All right, this one's almost done. Ah, it does. I'm gonna go ahead and start the uh, Dragoon range upgrade, because that's good no matter who you are. No matter what units you have, I feel like there's always Dragoons somewhere in the army. All right, fleet beacon still working. Should I get Psystorm? Psystorm's probably pretty good versus the old Zerg bugs. Um, I feel like this mission is actually going to take a little while, so definitely definitely uh, sit back and relax, guys, because we're going to be here for a little while. We're going to go ahead and build pylons down there. Ah, Fleet Beacon. Here it is. It's just time. There's the upgrade that I was looking for. Might as well build the first carrier. And what we're going to do is, is build a bunch of pylons here. Maybe put some cannons here just to be safe. Actually, for now, let's put some up here. Cannons there. One there, and how about one up there just to be safe? More probes. More probes. The barrier. There's that. Any upgrades finished? Yep. All right, so plus two attack. Dragoon range halfway done. And we're going to start adding on. Ah, I can't really do that many Stargates, huh? Maybe just one Stargate for now, and we're going to find. We are going to find another base. That's actually what I really need right now. Is definitely another base. Maybe I should build a gateway. Maybe maybe that's actually a good choice. Alright, let's do let's do gateways back here. Alright, so we got the carrier on the way, carrier upgrade on the way. Good upgrades there. And yeah, I think for now, we're gonna have to rely on some zealots. Where is the uh there it is. Start that. What is this? Oh god, why are there so many units here? No, leave my probes alone! Leave my probes alone! You got it, Artanis! Oh my god! Oh my god! Oh, this is actually a lot of stuff. Uh, Artanis, be careful. Be careful. But my, my probe, my probe count was, uh, was actually reduced there. And that, uh, that really sucks. Here we go. Come on, take it out. Kill that stupid overlord. Get him out of here. 
All right, let's uh, let's get some more gateways. Yeah, I'm super low on gas right now, so gateways it is. Ah, uh, I got my first carrier. Got my first carrier. All right, we gotta put our Tannis. He's he's pretty low on HP, so we're gonna put him back there. And we have Zealot legs on the way. We got upgrades going. Let's work on. The, we got Dragoon range on the way. Let's uh let's just see what's between these two bases. See if it's if it's uh, if I can just head straight to the base or if there's something in between. Is that oh we found something? No, back up, back up. You don't want to take any damage. Oh dear, oh dear. There's a lot of stuff. Uh, this is this zealot's pretty brave. We'll uh, we'll give him that. All right, carrier. There you go. All right, as long as we have the. Oh god. Oh my god. All right, kill that. Kill that uh, ultralisk at least. All right, we gotta we gotta rethink this here. Cause I don't I don't have an observer, and that's apparently going to be a problem here. So we are going to build a robotics facility, Robo Bay. Put it up right there. No, don't you dare. Don't you dare. All right, we're gonna build a lot of zealots here because we still have a lot of minerals, but uh, not a lot of gas. And we'll see how good zealots are. I think that it's mostly dependent on their upgrades, really. So zealot legs is done though, so that's nice. And more upgrades. Let's build another forge. Basically, I think, uh, I wonder if my strategy, here's my strategy, I'll let you guys know what I'm thinking anyways, is get lots of upgrades, and then every unit I make is tons better. Okay, so these guys are over here, Salt Lakes is done. So that's kind of nice. And carriers are here. Got the upgrades good, I guess just more zealots, man. Just boom, 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 boom. Let's set the rally point though. One, two, three, four, and five. What? What? We got these carriers. Yes. The upgrade just finished in time. Dragoons, I need you now more than ever. Run away, carrier. Run away. This is why I should build more cannons here, though. Because if they keep sending in air units, that's going to prove. Oh, God, I forget. You have to build the observatory. I always forget about the observatory. Because in this game you had to build that before you could make uh, you can make observers. So just a, just a fun fact. Get some cannons going there. More zealots. My overzealous zealots. And I don't even have enough gas for this yet. All right, so here's the plan. Once I get the observers, we're gonna attack from multiple directions. It's gonna be fine. Nothing could possibly go wrong. This probe, you you have a suicide mission. Actually, first off, let's have you build pylons. I don't know if that's gonna help the pathing or not, but we're gonna we're gonna just try it. Oh, you just can just get through there. Whatever, whatever. Okay, we got the zealots now. So these guys are pretty much ready. This is hotkey group number one. You guys are gonna be hotkey group number two and number three. All right, so I don't know if this is gonna work. I definitely need observers though. There they are. Get the observers going. And oh, this guy actually made it pretty far. Not too bad. There is a base over there. And let's go ahead and do pylon. We're gonna protect our forges with, with pylons. All right, so first off, we definitely have to kill this base. That is of the utmost importance. Oh, and the upgrades are still not even done. All right, all right, we don't have we don't have the gas for that. Whatever, they're on the way. They're on the way. And we'll protect these cannons here. I already know I'm gonna have a maxed out army, so I might as well might as well build lots of pylons now while I got the money. And we'll bring the dragoons along as well. The observer's done. We're gonna set this rally point. All right, so observers, you're gonna follow that, and you're gonna follow that. All right, here we go. And one. And oh, wait, wait, wait. Let's uh, let's. Yeah, I guess we gotta go here. One, two, three. You guys can do it. You guys can do it. You should wait up though. You should wait up. Actually, wait, wait. I got a plan. I got a plan. All right, you come over here. Carriers are gonna come up here and help. Hopefully, it's gonna be considered help. All right, where are their upgrades at? They're at no upgrades. I think these carriers can handle this, but at the same time, they're taking a lot of damage, so. No, don't attack your own interceptors. There you go. There you go. We're making progress already. Got carriers on the way. Can I make another carrier, actually? Yep, and more zealots. 
Might as well just make a million zealots. I feel like. Oh, oh, now we're moving in with the rest. We gotta bring in the observer. Bring in the observer. We got lurkers up here. All right, there it is. There it is. Take out those stupid lurkers. Take them out. Yes. We have no nope, help nope, observer. Get out of there. No. Oh, that's a lie. That's a lie. Whatever. We'll just make more. Instructions. And get some more interceptors. All right, someone just got kicked out of the hotkey group number one. All right, now unfortunately we have to wait until this creep proceeds to actually be able to expand here, but uh, I'm gonna figure it out anyway. All right, we've at least connected our two bases now. That's always nice. And we will take out the rest of this stuff. Take out that stupid spire. And can I start doing upgrades again yet? Because those upgrades are amazing. God, I need that gas so badly. We're just gonna go ahead. Do they have one geyser? I was hoping for two, but I don't really think they do that. And we're gonna get more upgrades. What? What warriors? What enemy? All right, let's just scout down here, make sure there's no hidden base. Knowing Blizzard, they're gonna hide one down there just to uh, just to drive me crazy. All right, we're gonna we're gonna fly through here just to see see if I missed anything. And I kind of want this observer. I definitely should get observer speed. God, it costs so much. Why does everything cost so much gas? Whatever, we're getting it. We're getting it. We're just going to stick with zealots for a long time. Hey, don't let them build here. You know what I've got to do, actually? All of you guys are going to be long distance mining gas for now. That is, that is how much I need gas. No, observer. I love you so much. We had so many good good times. How do I have so many minerals? I feel like I'm not playing this out right, but at the same time. All right, you're hotkey group number one as well. All right, we need interceptors. We need more interceptors. Instructions. All right, no, 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 you guys, uh, whatever, bring the minerals. I kinda, God, creep proceeds so slowly. Like, so slowly. That we should work on the armor upgrade. What Silent and exceeded? Jeez. All right, time to sacrifice some zealots, honestly. Because at this point, I am max supply. Is observer speed done? Not yet. Almost. Hey, hey, you guys come over here. Come here, Meatless. Why is that not in range of my cannon? Get him in range of the cannon. Get him in range of the cannon. Are you serious? Are you serious right now? Do I have to fly all the way over here to kill this? All right, well, I am max supply, but there's the uh, third upgrade. Yeah, I you like carriers, huh, stupid medalisks? Oh my god, are these views? I feel like these views are just randomly spawning. All right, we'll get, uh, get some cannon action up here. God knows I can afford it. All right, what is that? Okay, let's get hotkey groups one. Three, huh? All right, so hockey group number one, come over here. Oh god, there's so many zealots. Hockey group number two, and assigned over there. Hockey group number three, you also can go over there. Apparently, I have a hockey group number four in the works. So that's a thing. No, not the lurker. Where's my observer? There it is. I have another observer somewhere. I still know where he actually ended up. Any observers up here? Yes, there is. All right, you're gonna follow this zealot. What orange mutalisks? What happened? Oh god, I have like five control groups of zealots. That is how many guys I actually have right now. All right, there we go. One, two, three, four, five. Everyone over there. I think I can actually build a nexus now. Can I? Please just build this nexus somewhere. All right, screw it. We're putting it there. I don't even care. You guys are going in there. All you guys are mining gas. Oh god, I have more than five control groups. Whatever, we're uh, we're gonna figure this out. We're gonna find somewhere to attack. Because we're the Protoss, we're a little bit restless. Upgrades are looking mighty fine though. At least this is a good time to use all the gas. All right, here we go. Where are we going? One, two, three, four, five. I don't want to go to the temple just yet. I'm not, I'm not feeling like some temple right now. No, nope, scourge. No, run away. Run away. No, it's so much damage. It's so much damage. That was so unfortunate. All right, where's my observer at? I hear, I hear lurkers up here. I heard one observer just die. 
So we, uh, we definitely got to keep the observers alive. All right, so there's that. Let's, uh, let's go ahead and work on a carrier. Actually, let's work on some more of these. And not, not bad. Unfortunately, my carriers took some big hits there. Apparently, these guys are still alive. Is this a base, or is this just lots of... Yes, it is a base. All right, all right. We got to kill the creep-producing structures. You guys, kill this. We got we to gotta get that creep proceeding immediately. Yay, the Nexus is done. More probes. We can actually transfer over, like, all these guys. Upgrades are done, for the most part. Still got some observers going. Got those upgrades. I can start carrier production once again. Although I'm still kind of maxed out supply because I'm not actually using I'm not losing as many of you guys as I thought I would be. Alright, do I have my observer over here somewhere? I hope so. I actually don't know where that observer went. Losing track of my observers since 1998. Alright, you guys go over there. There's probably lurkers, but whatever. Uh, what are, uh, we'll send everything. Probably a little bit of overkill, but what can you do? Okay, go ahead and take that out. I want to kill as many Zerg bugs as possible. You guys are going to be control group zero because I don't want to lose track of you guys again. All right. You zealots. Can probably not have to guard here anymore. Let's just, let's just scout up here and see. Let's just see what we got. We can throw away a couple units here and there just to just see what the map's all about. All right. Control one, two, three, four, five. Good luck. And I need to free up some supply, actually. Can you can you guys just die, actually? I feel like these upgrades are making my units way too strong. That is another base, though. Oh, no! Oh, we made a huge mistake. We made a huge mistake. That is the wrong side of town. My god. All right, let's clean this stuff out. All right, well, I guess uh, at this point, we just need to clean out the temple, it looks like. All right, so you guys go over there. I don't think I need observer range. But I definitely need some carriers. Lots and lots of carriers. So let's build that there. Let's build one more. So I finally have that second gas. You guys need to come in here too. And over there. I also saw that we have a new found base right there. All right, you, you show those overlords, guys. All right, the observer's trying to get up here safely. Looks like that will be a success. Back up. No, Dragoon. Dragoon, I need you. All right, good. Yes, use the broodlings on my uh, on my ground units. That would actually be great. More upgrades done. Let's work on shields. I feel like you guys should actually mine... Oh, he killed my probe. That's not cool. That's not cool. I was counting on him to uh, to build my new base. Come on, you guys can find some better mineral patches. Why are you guys so clumped up? Oh, God, there's even more. Even more probes. All right, you guys are going to mine over here. And these probes, one of them is going to come up here. Definitely have to make all this creep recede. Ah, oh, there is gas over here, though. I wonder how long we have to defend the temple for. Is it a long time? I don't remember. Stupid Zerg, you didn't kill any of them, did you? Hopefully not. Alright, so you... Uh-oh. Not Broodling! No! Oh, he slowed it down. Alright, that's that's way better than a Broodling. Alright, you guys come over here. You're going to build that. And can we fit a Nexus right here? Really soon. Oh, this probe, you can make it! No! No, Zealot, save him! Save him! Come on, probe. Get there. Yes! Yes, we need more Nexuses! We need more next eye. Oh, that is so many units. Are you kidding me? Where did that come from? Oh god, broodlings are running up here. All right, we gotta we gotta change our game plan. We need more dragoons. I think dragoons are what our army is missing right now. Also, carriers don't help or don't hurt. All right, those broodlings will eventually run out, right? All right, if I'm remembering this correctly. What? Are you serious, Hydeless? Now? Can I please just build a nexus? Oh god. Oh god. Things are happening everywhere. These broodlings better run out before they kill that. Alright, we need a hockey group to come down here and protect this, because this is not going well. Right, you guys, yeah, come kill these stupid broodlings. And you need to build cannons. We need lots 
and lots and lots of cannons. What? No! The Nexus! How could you? Why would you do that to me? All right, here we go. It's can it's it's definitely cannon time. And get that one going. Try a little probe. You can do it. All right, that's the tear. Oh no, that's the Nexus. No! Oh, I thought it was a cannon. All right, we'll at least place it slightly better. All right, here comes the probes back. I do not trust the Zerg one bit. We're gonna wait for that to receive a little bit, but for now, maybe set up an extra pylon just in case. Put the Nexus over here. This one looks like it's still receding. Are all upgrades done? Are we three, three, three? Nope. Plus two shields. All right, I am supply blocked once again. Can you guys even get out of here? No, you can't. All right, we gotta kill this. I think having a nice mix of dragoons and carriers are what we're missing. All right, we need a nexus here. I could probably hold the line now, but right, you're gonna try and make it all the way over there. And you three are coming up here. Let's begin mining there. We have another nexus on the way, which is a little bit overkill, but that's fine. Why does this creep take so long? God, it takes forever. But for now, I know that we need pylons. It says we've got to protect the temple, so I have a feeling that we're going to get attacked by a lot of stuff. Did this guy actually survived. No. No. Make it to the pylon. Make it to the cannons. You're so close. You're so close. Yes, you did it. You actually did it. I'm so proud of you. Okay, so there's that. All right, so where is... I feel like I actually have too many units. Which is not something I thought I would say. But we're gonna start killing each other. So I, gotta, I gotta make room for real units, man. I gotta make room for more carriers. Because this is way too much supply and zealots. You guys have served us well. But no, Kerrigan's really the bad guy, it's not me. Don't mind that I'm killing all my own people. Gotta be the lucky one. Who's gonna be the lucky one to survive? Alright, this freed up quite a bit of supply, so that's nice. Maybe get some more dragoons. Actually, 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 hang hold on to your butts. Let's get some size storm. We we definitely need some archons up in here. As well as size storm. Alright, you guys come up here. I don't know if this is a little bit overkill, but this, this is what we're going with. It's probably overkill now that I think about it. But hey, we got the we got the money to do this, so why not? You guys come up here, we can start mining some of the minerals. Are we? Oh god! No! No, that's my that's my Templar research! What are you doing? Why is there a random such a random guardian down here? What is this? Come on, cans, you can do it. You can do it, cannons! Oh, we got random zealots everywhere, man. We have got to kill off these zealots. Well, at the same time, they are making dark swarms, so these zealots will be, will be helpful. All right, just uh, just making some more cannons. No big deal. We got lots of money coming in, oh, basically everywhere at this point. You guys, go uh, go go build over there. Ah, get out of here. Forget about it. More cannons. We're almost ready. We're almost ready to begin the process. We just gotta build lots of cannons everywhere, that's it. What? No! No! They're getting smarter. All right, we're gonna send him down here to protect this. Oh my god, our two Zergling seriously gonna kill all this? Seriously, probes, are you this bad? Come on! Yes, got one. Yes, we survived. At least for now. Uh, I guess I can, should I make more, transfer more? I don't know. All I know is it's time for more cannons. Lots and lots and lots of cannons. All right, I designed this horribly. Whatever. Little pylon out here. 
I I playing this Sim City style, okay? That's just that's just how it's gonna be. All right, Zeratul, don't you dare let me down. Oh wait, I can't leave you down here to defend, huh? All right, you guys can you guys can start heading up here. We're almost ready for you. Okay, I think we have enough gas for now, so we'll go ahead and build up here. Can't believe they killed my freaking storm research. That's not very nice. Guess we gotta build another one. I forget if I built it already or not. All right, well, you guys are just gonna be archons because it's gonna take forever. Uh, take out these guys. Get some more interceptors. All right, here's some gateways to absorb some damage. That's uh, that's your job, your guys' job, is to absorb damage. Yes, Archons. Power overwhelming. I feel like my money income is not where it should be. All right, so you guys are going to come up here. You're going to build some more cannons. And then we are ready to roll out. The only place I haven't built is here, but that's okay. Alright, do I actually need to build more probes? Is that is that actually a thing? You have not enough minerals. Actually no, let's uh let's let's have the income be up here. And where are my heroes at? You have not enough minerals. Affirmative. Where are my heroes at? You address me. Alright, we'll send Artanis in first. Direct my Good luck, Artanis. Rush is secured. I do this for iron. Actually, you guys should probably be mining here. That's uh, that's a lot closer. And you guys as well. Okay, so I finally got some income again. So that's gonna be good. That guy, that guy's mining at his own uh, little house down there. And we're gonna start this bad boy up, whether or not we're ready. Here we go. I just do not want to lose this mission. Can you believe if I actually lost right now? That would be so sad. Oh god, where'd he go? Stupid broodlings. Well, thanks for the dark swarm, bro. I don't know how I can see this unit, but oh, it's the observer right there. Derp de derp. There's that. More cannons. We're gonna have quite a few cannons up in here. No, run, zealots! Run, no! It's okay. It's okay. We needed that supply anyway. All right, there we go. There we go. Now the cannons are starting to kick in a little bit. Hey. Hey, you leave me alone. You guys leave me alone. It's nice to have some money. All right. I hope you guys are ready for this. Because I sure as hell am not. Executor. Zeratul and I will begin to channel the temple's energies. You must prevent the Zerg from destroying the temple while we work. I don't be with you, Executor. All right, this has already been a really long video. How long does it take? All right, 15 minutes. And that's in Blizzard time, which is not real person time. So we're gonna keep making cannons. I feel like I should even make some more probes. Get little groups of people everywhere. You guys over here. You guys over there. You up here. Carriers back up here because we've got no scourge are gonna be on the way. I think I had Archon somewhere. Yeah, you guys can come up here. Did I ever research Storm? I don't think so. Nope. Alright, let's keep these guys in Templar form. Hopefully, hopefully they'll actually make it over here. Highly unlikely though. And I think we are pretty good to go. Hopefully. Fingers crossed anyway. Just, just keep making cannons. That's really, that's really all you can do at this point. All right, actually, I should build a pylon over here. Maybe even one over there. So now the countdown timer has begun. We got 13 minutes to go. Which is a whole lot of time to build cannons. Oh, did you get stuck back there? Gosh darn it. Try, try not getting stuck this time, okay? Oh my god, the Templar actually made it. And I believe we're researching Storm. Yes, we are. Yes, we are. Uh-oh, I hear a Guardian. Those Guardians must pay. The guardians can outrange cannons, which is not cool. 
Which is why I definitely need the art or the uh, the carriers alive. Just gotta watch out for the scourge. Nope, nope. That's uh, that's our key to leave. No. All right, probe. You you gotta replace the other one that died. Yes, kill the guardians. No scourge. Oh god. Oh, they do so much damage. They do so much damage. We gotta try and rebuild these. All right, you should you should probably back up for now. Let's just let's just get cannons going every which way. Try not to lose all my carriers just yet. All right, you guys go over there. These poor poor probes are so getting picked on. All right, so the main thing I gotta watch out for is guardians. As long as I can, uh, as long as I keep my carriers away from the scourge. Oh my god, this one zergling has two kills already. Uh, uh, he's killing my fleet beacon. There's nothing to do about it now, except send in more high templar. Oh god. Oh, we don't have size storm yet. We do not have size storm yet. So the only answer, more cannons. All right, he'll eventually get too close to a cannon. And that'll, that'll be the end of him. Alright, build another pylon. We got 10 more minutes. Do I have Psy Storm yet? Where did I build this stupid thing? Oh no, I didn't begin researching! Oh god. Oh dear. Well, we're gonna have a lot of uh, high tempo, a lot of energy at least. And now I think we just uh, we just sit back and relax and enjoy the ride. Except they really want to kill us up. All right, High Templar, time for you to retreat. Because it's just not working out. And maybe, maybe I can rebuild my infrastructure up here. They haven't attacked us in a while. I'm sure they will pretty soon, but until that day comes, screw it, I'm not going to be baited out there by that stupid Guardian. All right, screw it. Yes, I am. I must save my cannons. We are under attack. Oh, Guardians every which way right now. All right, we got to get that. Let's get lots of these going. We are under attack. And probably lots of cannons as well, just to be safe. Okay, we killed those Guardians. Come over here and kill these ones. You guys can do it. I have faith. And let's go ahead and build some cannons right now. They were attacking over here, but it doesn't look like they are anymore. And kill those stupid guardians. Kill the guardians. Don't let the scourge come in. I hope the scourge don't come in. If you ever if you ever hear someone knocking at your door and you say who is it and they say scourge, don't let them come in. They will just crash right into your face and kill you. These hydralisks. These jerky hydralisks. Carrier. Wait, I'll have fleet beacon. Alright, so there's all that. Let's go ahead and build uh build some gateways, get that going. They've made a dent in my armor! What? Who can't build? Why can you not build a gateway there? Do I even want to know? There's probably something burrowed there. Four gateways. This is this is my backup plan. All right, now's your chance to shine. Yeah, how you like me now? How you like me now? You still down there? Let's find out. Nope. Let's come down here. I don't know if I have enough uh, energy after actually spamming it, but here we go. One storm on you. Yes, it's so good. It's so good! Wait, wait, there we go. Did I hit all of them? Nope. More storms, who's got energy? You have energy. Carrier, carrier. Oh god, the guardians! They broke it through on the right side! You can do it, carriers! I believe in you! We should definitely rebuild those, though. That was a lot of cannons. We are under attack. Alright, where are my High Templar at? Where are all my High Templar at? 
All right, you guys are going to attempt attempt to run a 20 minute mile, but make it all the way over here. All right, so far carriers are uh, doing their job quite well. Any more cannons? So far, only four minutes to go. Will it be enough? Will my defense be enough? I think so. I'm feeling good, because even if they were to start killing my buildings right now, I feel like they wouldn't be able to kill the temple by then. You know what, stupid lurkers? I've had it with you canceling my cannons. There's a guardian somewhere. Yeah, Archon, you got this. Go, go, go. Don't worry, the Templar will avenge you. Or maybe the Dragoon, either way. Yes. Yes, your drops do nothing. I should build Corsairs just because I can. Yes, kill that stupid ultra. All right, I feel pretty good. We only got three minutes left. My carriers are still alive. My cannon count's not bad. Everything else is looking good. I'm still maxed out. We are under attack. And I think that uh, that's going to be enough. So they're, they're just going to play with their crystals inside. This is going to be one of the longer games, I feel like. Yeah, Corsairs, you make the coolest attacking sound ever. Let's put you guys up here. Let's uh, let's bait these overlords into the cannons. Here we go, here we go. Into the cannons with you. There we go. Push them towards the cannons. All right, these Corsairs will be having fun down there for a little while. Kill these stupid flying units like the queen. Oh, oh, that's uh, that's not somewhere we want to be. Did they seriously drop an ultra down here? Uh, whatever. Whatever. What's going on? Another overlord. Well, if this is all you guys got, then you ain't got enough. One last minute for victory here, which I'm actually super excited about. So, Corsair. Good to go. And I, I, I just love watching carriers. I don't know about you guys, but oh no, our best wing geyser has been depleted. Storm all the zealots! Storm all the zealots! Oh, I, I'm the best commander. I, I'm the best commander this world has ever seen. Let's be honest. All right, 40 seconds. Let's just uh, let's just go scout around a little bit. Let's go have fun with it. This poor guy has been like the forever alone pro man. He has mined 600 minerals by himself, or more than that actually. Like seven, eight hundred, man. All right, let's see what's up here. Not that it matters because the game's gonna end in 10 seconds, in eight seconds, in six seconds. And oh, there's a lot of stuff up here. The channeling is complete. Withdraw our forces into the temple and brace yourself. All right, I guess they will all fit in there. So, Ready for battle. hey, the Zerg are—they're uh, being nice. They're not—they're not attacking. Yes, we finally beat it. I forget—is there—is there a cinematic or how does how does this work? I want to say there's a cinematic.
Yay, no more Zerg bugs. Oh wait, there's a lot of Zergs still remaining. But either way, I believe that the uh, the protest campaign is now completed. I didn't realize it was only, was that eight missions? Yeah, it was only eight missions. So, whoops, uh, that's the protest campaign, which uh, we've already done. So now it is time to start the Terran campaign. I hope you guys are ready for this because things are heating up. We've killed off the Zerg, but guess what? Kerrigan hates us as per usual. All right, hope you guys enjoyed, and I'll see you guys next time.